<laughs> We've been hearing this music for the last 10 minutes over nice try I swear every time you guys are here the first thing everyone does is gamble and try to hit me Is this how you say hello to your host? Yes. How nice. Uh, horror music be like... <laughs> well, hello- yeah, it is kind of horror a little bit, isn't it? I, we don't exactly know the theme of what our- of what this game- hey, there's readable. What up, Reed? Hey, hey readable. I don't actually know the theme of what this story is about, even though it's a recommendation by our own Lemafow in the chat, if he's here. I saw him earlier. Hello, Lemafow. But, uh, <laughs> I match- I match the color aesthetic very well. <laughs> Look at Could me. be a lot more red. Sh shift the hue towards the left. I don't like it. What? <laughs> shift the hue slightly to the left. I don't like it. It's too I blue. mean, I could like, <laughs> I could like switch to that, that that version of me. You know the one, right? <laughs> I see. But we're not gonna do that. We're saving that for a special occasion. Yes, yes. What do you mean you can't redeem? You did, are the redeems not working? Or, or is it on cooldown? If the bonk might be on cooldown because Max... No, Max, we're not pulling it out. Not unless it's time for the thing. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, I'm glad you know what I'm talking about. But hello, everybody. Welcome to Jack in a Castle. It is nice to see everybody. As you can see, we're playing another Nemla game. Because it has been requested that we basically go down the list of their HIO. How many Everyone are we missing at this point? Two? <laughs> I don't know. I think two. Two. It's, uh, what's the other one? It's, 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 uh... Good question. <sighs> I forgot. We have a list and everything. I just genuinely forgot. <laughs> but, yeah, before we go on to the game, how is everybody? Kamustahan tayo dito, which means, uh, let's ask each other how we are. So, how are you guys? How are you, Mr. Pyre? I'm doing all right. Gotta right. play Jack in the Castle with a cringe uh, fireball who likes to be called mommy, but you know what this is? I right. don't like being called that and you know it. <laughs> I dislike being called that and you know it. That's good to hear that you're good, Vax. Listen to me. You listen to me, young man. No. Yes. No. Mom. No. Max, please. No, I don't want to have to <laughs> ban you from my chat. Please don't do this. I don't want to have to ban you. Don't do this. At some point, if this gets- if this turns into a thing, I'm banning that word from my chat. Do you understand me? <laughs> no, I'm kidding, Max. I'm not actually gonna do that to you. Ban me, you coward. Ban <laughs> me, you coward. <laughs> but yes, Jack of the Castle. I don't- uh, I'm assuming, judging from the screenshots I've seen of this and some of the posts I've seen online, that this is again, of course, a story about crazy people. What's and new? What, what's new about Nemlay games? And of course, we can't forget that one of them is going to be Pyre's femboy bunny persona. Femboy bunny persona. I see. I was half tempted to call this stream. Uh, what was it? Playboy Castle. Because there is a little bunny boy there. And you yes, he coward. It's already. I'm. I'm pretty sure jacking in the ca ja Jack's railing a castle. Jack's railing castle is already pretty bad. Jack's castling, he's playing chess. Oh, does Nemle say that this is their worst game? Interesting, I did not know that. That means we gotta play it. Well, now we gotta play it if they say it's their worst. Now we gotta play it. Let's start. Who the fuck? Oh, God. Who the, oh, who the fuck yo. are these dudes? Oh, yo, it's the... Yes. But, okay, is this literally just how it starts? That's what- that's literally just how it starts. I haven't touched it. By the way, this is- if you're from the Philippines, is this not the Enchanted Kingdom? <laughs> it is the Enchanted Kingdom. It's Shut the, the fuck up. Shut it's the, the fuck up. It's the Enchanted Kingdom Wizard. I only went to Enchanted Kingdom twice, by the way. The first time, it was pretty fun because I was six. Okay. The next time, I went there when I was 15. I wasn't fun it. anymore. It wasn't fun anymore. By the way, for anyone who's wondering what the hell we're talking about, uh, <laughs> right off the bat, we're gonna go off on a tangent. In the Philippines, the one of the more famous amusement park places is called Enchanted Kingdom, and the mascot is basically this gray-bearded wizard in purple. 
So basically, this guy we're looking at right here, he looks like what would have happened if the Enchanted Kingdom wizard uh, went on crack and then got withdrawal. I'm gonna send a picture of that <sighs> Enchanted Kingdom wizard in the Discord at some point, but yeah. yeah. Yes, yes, <laughs> This yes. is that. I need my next hit! Okay, I, I, I can already hear the voice for this girl. It's giving it's giving Charlie from Hasbin. All right. Charlie from Has. I actually have not seen Hasbin hotels. Blonde hair, Violet. blue eyes, pale. Blue eyes, white dragon. Blue eyes, white dragon. Stop. All My right. Blue eyes, white dragon. You. All right, you gotta pull out your Yoda light and except without the accent. Or do you like, want the what? accent? Wait, what do you mean? Like Yoda, Yoda Linen. Oh, Yoda Linen. I think you said Yoda. Yoda, Yoda Linen. Don't be scared, Marion. You got this. So very clearly, I am a doll. Or I'm Aegis. 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 Sorry. Blue eyes doll, literally. Y yeah. You'll be fine as long as you're just fine. What the fuck does that even mean? Did Nemli <laughs> say this might be their worst game because of this? Yes? We're all counting on you. That's what Master said, but I can't even find my way to the castle. We ask. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Where the fuck is this? This should have been Playboy Castle. Okay. Oh, this is Nemli's first ever game? Dang! Uh, I did not know that. That would make sense. There's literally uh, no well, intro. We're just going to a castle. Excuse me. <laughs> uh, is this? You said this was a pen boy, but is this a dude or is this a girl? There's no. There's no. I can't tell. Should I do it then, or should you? You want to give it your best uwu cringe pyre? Sure. <clears throat> well, hello, hello there, dearie. Oh god, my soul. Having trouble finding my way to the castle. I thought I'd see it once I arrived in town, but, um... Oh yes. Getting in the castle is tricky indeed. Why'd a doll like you want to enter that wretched place anyway? Oh, it's him! It is okay, him. let's go! Did we tell him? Uh, sure. We are uh, truthful. I'm a servant there, starting today. <gasps> Contact inside! Uh... You can count on me. I'll get you there right now. A according to Max, the only girl in the entire game is the doll. It's me, so... <laughs> <laughs> I see. Alright then. Follow me. Hey! We're here. Oh, damn. What a... This, okay, stylistically Lovely. speaking, I know Nemli said this is their first game, but stylistically, this is already so striking. The art's, guess, uh, like, the so art's always good. I guess it's, it's just so the good. writing. This is their first game, meaning that this is, like, yeah. when they considered their art undeveloped. Oh, I th uh, really? I thought I thought they said this was bad because of like the presentation, the writing, rather I than don't the art. Know. The art All that Max oh. said in the chat was that don't. This is my worst. This is my first game. This is bad. Don't play it. That's it. There's no like explanation as to what they meant. I see. What the? Oh yeah, that thing has been crumbling to bits for a good while now. It's been like that ever since the king stopped showing his royal face to his commoners. Some say he's been cursed, so that's why. Others say the king has died and haunts the place. I want to go back home. I got you here, so you're going to help me out, all right? I didn't agree to anything like that. Just find me a way to sneak in. I've got to find out what's going on in here myself. Okay, for some reason... Twitch yeah. wouldn't let Max say twink without having me approve the message first. <laughs> That's funny. It's like Ninja all over again. Oh no. I don't know. Thanks. Counting on you. Hey, I didn't 
the bunny plushie boy has hopped off somewhere else. Is the this really rabbit. even the place? His name is literally plushie boy, plushie rabbit. Oh. Hey, checkerboard. I made my way through the jungle. I can only assume used to be a garden. At the gates, a moody looking guard let me in. He told me to find Jack, a, a Jack in the box. Name Jack. Aha. Uh -huh. Where should I look? Bitch, I don't know. Wanna go? I don't know. You wanna go? Oh, you don't know? All right. There's a big hallway that looks as warped as everything else. All the doors are locked. Okay. Do I even have a fucking night? Uh, I guess I don't have like a. Oh, halt. I know what to do. Hold you have on. a halt. Give me voice. a sec. Give me a sec. I know what to do. I know oh what to my do. god, no! <laughs> Not the voice filter that he's about to. <laughs> no, children. We are going to have to wait I'm for a our honor. We're I'm going to have to wait for our honored, then, for one of our honored guest storytellers to grab his actual IRL night helmet. No, no. <clears throat> Who are you? Holy shit! <laughs> I, I'm Marion. The, uh, I don't like that voice. Hold up. I'm Marion, the new servant. Oh, oh so okay. cute. Welcome to the, uh, to the castle. And your name is. You should. Sorry. What were you saying? No, no, it's okay. Uh, go on. Um. Ha. Ha ha. If you're looking for the boss, he's probably in the tower right now. What are you speaking through? A toilet paper roll? No. What is I that? Got you got a cup. I'm a practical oh. effects genius, cow. <laughs> I know, I was about to say. That's an odd place. Why couldn't you have said an actual helmet? I'm not that cool. He, lo <laughs> he likes the, the view, I suppose. Anyway, goodbye. When do you think the last time this guard met a female? Now. <laughs> I didn't get his name. You know what? You're a doll, right? Are you like the Bloodborne doll? <laughs> Welcome home, good hunter. The stairs never seem to end. It's really uncomfortable and a bit dark, too. But once I make my way to the top floor, the view from the small window is great. Someone has carved the word Jack onto the wooden door. No answer. It's probably locked, but I'll try anyway. That is a big box. He's not here. And what are these fine things? The whole castle is more or less overtaken by them. Oh, it better not be mold. Floor spaghetti? Mmm. <laughs> Castle mm. spaghetti? Tasty. Somebody call Al and, and uh, tell him that there's a bigger source of spaghetti for him. Yummy spaghetti. Yes, Free yes. Pasta. Castle spaghetti. There's also a curious looking box. It's probably the, the, the jack in the box. I don't know about that, Chief. Maybe maybe it's just a cool box. I open the box. Inside is a bed, ha. Huh? Who would want to sleep stuffed in a square space? Tom. This video was cute. sponsored by Square No, it's not. Oh. <laughs> I want you I want this to be a dachi. Do you understand me? Yes. <laughs> this is what I want from you. <laughs> All right. Okay, Ch let's take a moment, children by the fire. Let us take a moment as I conjure in this image in front of you. Does this man, not right here, not look like this little twink right here? I don't know what you mean, Chief. <laughs> no, legitimately, if you look at the stream right now, <laughs> look at it. It's uncanny. You look like the glowed up version of this character right now. Which, by the way, thank you is for the character models. We love you. Thank you. You're Marin Marionette. How creative. You scared me, Mr. Jack. I'm sorry. It was my full intention. I was uh, looking for you. And you found me. What are you going to do next? Hmm? Uh. I bet you didn't think that far. No, I did not. Damn. I bet you don't think at all. Damn. Huh. Well, no matter. It's all right. You're a halfwit. This is you. 
I don't know what you mean. <laughs> I don't know what you mean, son of a bitch. At least you're easy on the eyes. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice to meet you. Personal space, sir. That's all I ask. The pleasure is all mine. Is this the face you make when conversing? No, I'm I'm sorry. I forgive you, of course. We've already established your lack of intelligence, after all. I swear to God, if this is a love interest, I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> this is not gonna happen. I don't know that. That she... <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we need a Jack version of Pyre, so it's basically, yeah, no, we'll get what if, if Pyre wants to, we might get Wiz on that. <laughs> but I do have high expectations for <laughs> you, so please work on that. All right. Aw, come now. I'm sorry I'm so harsh on you. Let me show you to your room. Is this the king of the castle? Yes, he's the Jack in the castle. Damn, how homie. Here you go. Here's your keys and here's your bed. You will sleep here until you wake up and then I will show yeah, you around. You're getting a little cute there. What? The voice is getting a little too cute there. That's fine. <laughs> all right, all right. The manic will come out <laughs> later. Uh, thank you, sir. You start tomorrow. Good night. There's nine endings? Jesus! I didn't think I'd get my own room. This might not be so bad. Jesus! <laughs> my goodness! Mr. Jack! Forgot to say welcome aboard. Good night. I hate this place. But <laughs> I'll do it for Master. Listen, Marion. My fellow intellectuals are worried about the land of Toxyboxian. Toy Boxian. Toxy Boxian. Toxy Boxian. Toxy Boxian. Yep. Toxy Boxian. <laughs> That's the name yes, now. That's I the can name definitely now. Definitely read. <laughs> Seems the king hasn't shown himself in months now. His right hand man has completely taken his place. My dad's r rubbing his heart. Rubbing his holly. Vroom, vroom. He's a. Tw you want me to wait until that's over? It's going. Vroom. I, we don't hear it. You don't hear it? Damn, that's crazy. Barely. He's a toy named Jack. So Jack is not the king. Jack is, let's just say, he's Huxy very, Sawyer. well, let's T. not say anything. T! Hi, T! T said vroom vroom. We vroom, love you, vroom. T. Hello, Hello T. T. T's nuts. I want you to go work under him as a servant. That way, you can undercover what is going on over there. Uh, what do you think is the reason, Lumafau, by the way, that they don't want to play, they don't want people to play this game? Do you think it's because they think it's bad, or...? I'll do it. But why me? I'm not particularly good at anything. That's precisely why. You're a hapless, clueless idiot. Thanks. You won't pose any kind of threat, and he'll let his guard down. I see. Thank you, sir. I have utmost faith in you. I'll utilize all my haplessness and cluelessness. Good morning! What the? <laughs> uh, just barge in, why not? Good morning? You're late. I'm giving a speech to my subjects today at, at this instant o'clock. You are? I wish you would have told me yesterday. I didn't know yesterday that I'd give a speech tomorrow. But today came, and I knew. I'll give a speech right now. At once, Sir Jack. Whoa. King Jack today. But you don't have to bow down, because we're late. Yes, your majesty. I helped Jack dress up before dressing myself. Aww. Yes. This'll do just fine. Hey, when's the <laughs> cosplay coming, Par? Uh, I'm already cosplaying it right now. Is he really going out in public like that? I'll be off then. Yes, 
he is. I better Jack get ready it. for the day, too. He didn't show me around, after all. Where should I work? <laughs> no way! <laughs> uh. <laughs> There's already a cosplay you stole. But yeah, that's for fuck you, T. Jack didn't bother giving me any orientation, so I'm not gonna oh, lift a finger. Instead, I'll go look for the king. I think I hear something. We'll wait for fire. Hey, yo, this is basically Minato. Or Makoto. This is Persona 3 protagonist. <laughs> and I'm back. Sorry, my mom knocked on the door. Now, what are you doing? Ah, it's the Persona it. 3 protagonist. Alright. <clears throat> Quit pushing me this instant. Shut up. They'll hear you. I feel so sorry for you right now. That's fine. I've changed my mind. I'm going back. No, 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 Sylv. Sylv. Can I help you? <gasps> oh, it's just the dolly from the floor. Almost gave me a heart attack. See, Sylv? He's the one I was talking about. I think you mean she, but oh, wait, you're a Are you a dude too? <laughs> no, I'm not a dude. I think that's a mistake on Nemlay's part. Nemlay's not English speaking, if I remember correctly, right? Ah, uh, that makes sense. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, b -b 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 same question, basically. We are simply gathering intel. Yep. You really shouldn't be here. I have to call the guards if you don't leave. Guards, my hiney. Thanks to you, we can finally solve the mystery of the missing king. Let's discuss this somewhere else. They tell me what hap- They tell me what- it is. They tell me they want my help figuring out what happens to the king. I tell them I'm also here to find that out. It seems we have the same objective. See? I knew we'd find something good today, didn't I? I- did. Either way, my name is Sylvester. I'm Marion. And I'm... Really annoying. <gasps> Rude! I'm Bunny. <laughs> Pleasure to meet you, dear. How original, thank Bunny. you. Let's get down to business, shall we? That basket case Jack is out there giving one of his bizarre speeches again. Max said, why does this guy have to randomly make a 90 degree with his body? For the fan service. For the fan service. I figured this would be the perfect time to come snooping around. Yes. Many of the guards are watching over Jack right now. I suggest Marion guides us to the king's chamber. I don't even know how to get there, bro. Even if I wanted to, I don't know where here. that is. Don't you work here, honey? I just started yesterday. Surely you know at least some of the area. I guess? Then it's settled. Marion sneaks around with one of us. And one person can stay behind on watch. There's a direct view to the square. So we can see when the speech finally ends. Will you assist her on the castle? Let's go, Sylvester. You really? You speed right, Sylvester? No. <laughs> No, we're not doing this. We're not doing this. <laughs> we are not doing this. Your ass is speed clean. Your ass fucking quit scope. Your ass fucked. I don't know if you know this, but I, I play FPS. <laughs> yes, good choice. You make it sound like I was a bad choice, Sylv. No comment. Ah. <sighs> Get a move on it's then. also because I want to save Pyre from having to hold this voice for long. He'll say it's okay, but I know for a fact that anyone who has to do their voice out of a range for a long time, that shit's gonna hurt. I've had to do that for like three hours straight. Yeah, I know. Like <laughs> everyone in the the, the the chat is saying, "Yes, you will, Cal. You will eventually." Yes. We make sure there's no one around and sneak for the stairs. Even though most guards are at the square, I think this castle is oddly quiet. There's not that many people working here anymore. Once the castle started moving, uh, morphing into what it is now, most toys left. It's quite difficult. The castle used to employ a decent number of us. Us? 
I see. Can I ask you something? You can. What kind of toy are you exactly? I'm a music box. Oh, right. Look at the... Ah, the so, notes. So cute. A quarter, yeah, it's a quarter note. Oh. No, that's not a quarter note. That's, that's, a, a, that's not a quarter note. note. Yeah. <laughs> there, no. go. Shut up, it looks similar. What no, is that, it? Th 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 that's an eighth. That's an eighth? Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> are you okay? Are you good, bro? I work by feeling, not by sight. Are you I, surprised? Cl 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 clearly. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, uh, it's technically, I'm guessing it's an eighth note. It's missing the little flag, but it is basically an eighth note. It has the flag, what do you mean? It's reversed. The flag is usually on the right side. You know, it's fine. Um, I've only seen female ones so far. Ah, yes. I was a, uh, I was a part of a set originally. My partner was a beautiful young maiden. Every day we'd dance together to the most wonderful tunes. Until one day, she... Um... Stop trying to hit me. Oh, sit down! Trying to hit you. Nice try trying to hit me, sit down. <laughs> but I burned the stick. Hey, sit in. I burned the baseball bat. Until she got into beatboxing. Huh? I can't believe it. Now her core sounds like it's jammed broken. Uh... I can't dance with her anymore. Needless to say, we went our separate ways. This is now my favorite. <laughs> uh, I... Yes, yes. I see. Burn and holy fire. <laughs> I'm glad I finally got to tell someone about it. Bunny wouldn't understand. Bunny doesn't seem to understand much in general. But I decide not to say that out loud. So you and Bunny... Are you friends? I suppose one, can, uh, one could call us that. But I prefer the word acquaintances. Why do you ask? Oh, n no reason. Uh... I see. I hope my answer was satisfactory. Yes, yes, of course. But this is a conversation for another time. We must find the king. Sit down, thank you for dropping by. Thanks, sit down. Oh, the redeems are there, just really low. Whoops, let's bring that up, shall we? Wait, hold up. In case anyone hasn't noticed, Marion's a guy. Wait, are they, is Marion's not a girl? Damn, that's crazy. Marion's a guy? Huh? All right, Gregory. Oh, I have to pull the Greg voice? Cool. All right, Gregory. Well, okay, I'm, tr I'm literally trying all the blurbs right now. Yes. So oh, apparently you try the blurps? Let me go restroom real quick. Apparently it's slow. Why is it low? Marion is a guy, which means I have to pull out my Gregory from FNAF voice. Anyway, uh, does anyone, does anyone, does, does, like, it's maxed on my, on my end. Uh, it, the blurps are maxed, but I don't know how to make them any louder. Any louder, forgive me. So if anyone knows how to do that, that would be great. Because I do not know why they are low. Usually they're not low. I'm here. Hello. We're testing. Back? We're testing. Oh, We're testing. Hello. Like, apparently the redeems are really low. Hmm. Could you Better quickly take a check? Could you take a gander real quick? Take a gander? Okay. Messing around with an OBS. I have tried messing around with an OBS, and it doesn't seem like the OBS is the issue because it's maxed in OBS. It's maxed in OBS? Uh, did you lower your OBS uh, volume in the volume mixer? Let me see. Because that does affect the thing, which is stupid to me. Uh, it doesn't seem like it. No, okay. Let Hold me up, think. let me, let me... <laughs> Troubleshooting, children. I have called in assistance. Okay. I've called in a body. Somebody. 
Yes, I don't see anything that says... Yeah, no, I don't see anything. Oh, there's nobody here. Nobody. <laughs> no, but yeah, um, yeah, I don't know, T. Uh, uh, it's Max and OBS. I don't know what else could the issue uh, be. You want to stream your OBS to me? Let me see. Sure, sure, sure. Excuse us, children. Let us take a pause in our story. Oh, whoop. Ba, 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 ba. Uh, this is the first time I've heard it said it's low. It's usually not this low. I don't know what happened. So, yeah, okay, we'll fix that real quick. Mr. Pyre. Uh, how do I... Mm. Hold up. Change. There we go. Okay, let's see. <laughs> try playing uh, scroll already. Okay, there's your blurbs. Try uh, try playing a sound effect. Thanks, Max. Thanks for the biddies, Max. Thank you so much for the biddies, Max. No, that's full. Exactly, but according to them, it sounds low on stream. Are you guys sure you just turned off your volume down low? T. Oh, oh God, let, me, let me unmute. I'll mute it. Play, play it again, Cal. Oh, wait, okay. no. Burn in holy fire. Burn in holy fire! Okay, okay, uh, Cal, go to, uh, go to, go to the game scene and then try playing it. Oh, yeah, that might be Good. it. That might be it. We'll do that again. Scroll down to burst first. Scroll down to burst first. I saw this earlier. Okay, do it. Oh, God. I. the nerd. Nerd! It's gonna get Luminar on. Do I? Yeah. You don't have Luminar on. What? I do not I'm have Luminar on! What are you talking about, man? What the fuck? Huh? It shouldn't be... It shouldn't be low, then, huh? I do not understand. Control audio by the stream lines. Oh, they can hear me twice. Okay, but they can hear you twice because you're also on Mobius. Here's the thing, I just listened to my own stream, it's fine. What are you all talking about? <laughs> hold up, hold up. Uh, apparently, it was goofy. All right, just uh, mute. Uh, just, just mute the. Uh, the stop Hello there. Was that always unmuted? By the way, this stuff audio. No, it was just unmuted now. Okay. Uh, mute it and then play it again. It's good now, apparently. No, it's not. Okay, it is desktop audio. The blurps come from desktop audio. Mm -hmm. That's the issue. The blurps play from desktop audio. What? Why does it play from desktop audio? Right click blurps. I, I, I go to the blurps, right? And not on, on the mixer. And then go to advanced audio. Just just check what track it's on. Ah, oh, for fuck's uh, sake. Blurps. No, it's on both tracks. Damn, that's crazy. That's oh, because you're a modder only mute output, dumbass. Whoops. Oh, <laughs> that's right. When I was adding new shit. Whoops. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. Don't worry, kids. Monitor and output because desktop audio is off now. All yeah. right. Sorry, kids. Play that shit again. Here we go. Let's 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 try this. Hello there. Holy fire. Can you hear yourselves now? Are we good, everybody? I'm assuming we're good. Okay, T said yeah, clap. Good. That's good. All right, we solved it. We solved the crises. We love we audio issues. 
We solved the crises, kitties. Let's go yes. back to castling Jack. To jacking in the castle. Great, now I have to pull my Gregory voice. Shit, for real? You're, you're, you're streaming your screen instead of streaming the game to me. God damn it. <laughs> I'm tired, man. I don't know. There, am I streaming it? Is yeah, this correct you for you, Mr. Pir Pirata? Yes. What do you mean you're about to kill me, Max? What do I do? <laughs> Why are you gonna kill fire? Stop killing fire. Fire is important. Alright. <clears throat> Hi, sweetie. Hey, Lily. I don't understand. What are these vines? God, what's the Gregory voice again? I need to get- I need to line my head. What's- what's the Gregory voice again? <laughs> <laughs> what's the Gregory voice again? Oh, no. Stop, Lumberfowl. Don't finish that sentence. Ahead. Uh, uh. Some kind of plant? I'm not sure. I've never seen anything like them. Some of them look like they're poisonous. Indeed. Let's avoid touching the vines as much as possible. Uh, thoughts? Let's follow the vines. I'm not scared. I say we follow them. I agree. I'm curious about where they are coming from. However, I can't pinpoint the direction. Yeah, they grow all oh, around. Oh my god. I say we fall. That scared the shit out of me. Do you think these things are related to the missing king? It's hard to say. M hey, maybe the king ran away because of the vines. <laughs> mm. Uh, that was a joke. I don't understand which part was supposed to be funny. Uh, ha, ha. Anyway, let's keep going. You see, this is why bunnies cooler. I don't Seems know about the that. vines do not grow down here. Perhaps there is not enough light. So they are plants then. <sighs> or not? Your guess is as good as mine. However, we've been searching for a while. It's time we head back to Bunny. But we didn't find anything. Fortunately, that is not true. We found places where there are no clues leading to the king. Right. As our search continues, we'll eventually find something through the process of elimination. If you say so. There you are. So, where's the king? No idea. We will continue our search tomorrow. Ha! I knew it. But don't feel too bad. We'll find him tomorrow. I sincerely doubt that. Huh? There are still many places left unchecked. According to my estimations, we will have searched the whole castle within a week. A week? Why does it take so long? Well, we have to be mindful of the guards. We were lucky there were barely any of them here today. <sighs> I'll... See you guys tomorrow, then? Yes, we'll meet at the same spot as today. I help them exit the castle without being seen. I stare out of a window at the crowd Jack has gathered. There's a decent number of toys, but I'm sure it'd be a lot- What, what are you laughing at? Don't worry about it, Chief. Say it, say it, coward. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Chief. Do it! Say it! Say it with your chest! We're helping our, our, our uncle. Uh, we're helping our uncle Jack off a castle. All right then. <laughs> but I'm sure it'd be a lot more if the real king was giving a speech. The crowd starts scattering. Jack will be back soon, and I'll have no idea I've already betrayed him by letting outsiders into the castle. <sighs> well, we didn't even end up finding anything. Are you gonna be- are you gonna be- oh, you know, okay, you got Naruto, the fr the power of friendship. The power of friendship! Please, it's not too late. How dare you, it's not your turn. This is my ninja way! <laughs> this is my- <laughs> Naruto! <laughs> Our bond- <laughs> Our bond is making me Jar weak, Naruto. time for fire? T, is that- is that an official request to put fire in the jar? The jar is our bond. I must sever our bond, Naruto. Oh, that's not the joke. Naruto! 
Why are you? <laughs> what? Jar time? Is it jar time? I don't think Marion doesn't have a gender. As a fact of being a marionette doll, obviously. Put some girls' clothes on them. I don't know. This is my journey to be Hokage. Get the boring ending? We'll see. We'll see. Like, if push comes to shove, we'll ask you guys what choices to make to get certain endings. We'll just go through one playthrough where we'll just make our choices and then we'll see from there. If that's okay with everybody, yeah? Yep. Put him in the jar for that uncle comment. You know what? You're right. He does belong in the jar for that. Sorry, Pyre, you're going in the jar. You bastard. Uh, sorry, it's an official no. request from T. I, 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 I'm sorry, buddy. Just no. like T, no. T officially requested it. If I can find the, your jar, where did you put it? You, you hit it again, didn't you? You fool. This is my home. Only I know where it is. To get past me, you must answer my questions three. He had he hid the jar again, kids. He hid it in the grove. All right, time to search, everybody. If you find it, say it. Question number one. Yep, he's gonna... What is the Spanish word for yes? See, si. see si these nuts. Okay, this is just <laughs> prolonging his time in the jar. Shut the fuck up, <laughs> you son of a. <laughs> Shut the <laughs> fuck up. You know what? You know what? You deserve this. You deserve to be in the jar for this. I hate you. <laughs> Question number two. No. <laughs> Which four-legged beast has two wings, breathes fire, and has a tail? I'm not answering this. I'm not answering this question. Kids, you answer this one while I put him in the I put him where he belongs. Get in the jar. Get in the jar. Would you say I'm dragging this on? <laughs> I hate him. This is why you belong in that jar. You understand me? This is why you belong in that jar. <laughs> Someone I stop should... him. I don't know, T. I don't know if we can. He's he's the other get on our guest storyteller of the night. <laughs> Anyway, okay, if they have no gender, we're just gonna keep it gender ambiguous. I don't know. I'm sure we'll find something if we keep looking. Anyway, was I supposed to use this day to settle in? So, okay, we're not gonna go full Gregory. We're not gonna go full... She cut you off! Freddy, down here! And we're also not gonna go full, like... Was I supposed to use this day to settle in? So we'll be somewhere in the mid-range. Uh, okay. She is literally Gregory. Right? I mean, I didn't receive any instructions whatsoever. I'm sure Jack or someone will show me around tomorrow. Yagu! Hello, Take Yagu. This thing. He belongs in there, everybody. I'll just rest until morning. Turns out I was wrong. No one is helping me out at all. Other toys just pass by me as if I wasn't there. Jack hired me as a servant, but he hasn't told me exactly what I'm supposed to be doing. Does he think I already know, or is he just testing how lazy I am? <sighs> what do I do? Should you ask for work, or should you, ask, uh, should, you ask, should you meet Bunny and Sylvester? I feel like the path, how's our fireball mother doing? I'm doing just fine. Why is the jar half full? Ask Pyre. He's the one who's in it. Get uh, it, in I'm, it. Uh, what would you call I'm an opti uh, I'm an optimist. The jar is half full instead of half empty. Exactly. Uh, you know what? We've already made choices that basically kind of leans towards Bunny and Sylvester, so we'll start there for now. Okay. Well then, since no one seems to miss me, I'll keep looking for the king. You're here already. Yep, you're just in time. <laughs> Mama Fowl, please, no. Good to see you. So, what's the plan? I drew us a map based on yesterday. I expect it to be faulty, but it should help us skip the areas we've already covered. Not to mention how bad you are drawing, Syl. You're at drawing. I must say this... Okay, you are at drawing. Okay. Uh, I will say this, everybody. Try to avoid saying things that will get you auto-modded. <laughs> Because then it's not my fault anymore. <laughs> yes, that too. Jack isn't having a speech today, so there are more guards. But luckily, we've already covered Hi, the most Nicomi. common areas. Nice to see you again. Hello, Nick. It's been a while. Yeah, 
We're checking places no one cares about today. Still, we need to be extra careful. Marion? Yeah? I hope our previous failure hasn't discouraged you. I believe we'll do better today. Who will you assist around the castle this time? Okay, so a plushie, a music box, and a doll. We're still going with Sylvester. I'd like to go with you, Sylvester. What? Sylv again? Sheesh. I'm gonna greet the stinky mafia boy. Oh, say hi to Ajax for me. Shh. Let us continue our search. Fine. I'll just wait here, doing nothing. Excellent. We will see you later. Uh, he deserves the jar. Why is Pyre in a jar? Nekomi! You can see the VOD for it. And you know what? I might clip it. I might clip it. This is to show you exactly why he belongs in the jar for that. He deserves that jar. <laughs> so. Okay, we already covered this area. There, oh go. god! What? That's how visual novels work. No, we the the, the the lines. Oh, oh, we have already covered this area. We must go deeper in. I hate you. You did that shit on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you. I, I wouldn't have you. done it unless you pointed it out. <laughs> oh man. So where to? We will advance to the next floor. How are you saying I'm being weird again? It's his jar. He brought it to the grove. I don't know about that. He You're the brought one it to the grove. He brought it to the grove. Specifically, it was him, Readable, and T who brought it to my grove and decided to keep me, it here. You gave me the paperwork and you told me to bring it in my personal belongings. Nekomi said, Nekomi said, Nekomi said, if the water was any higher, Nekomi, sweetie, that is not water. It's part water. <laughs> I hate you. There's so. lactose in it. What? It's milk. I don't know. I don't know how you humans work. There are a <laughs> lot more vines here. Looks like we are getting closer to our goal. If vines are your goal, sure. Pardon? I mean, we're still looking for the king, right? It's not like the king is missing. He got stuck on some vine because he got stuck on some vines. I did not suggest that. And if he was, he's been stuck for months then. I said I didn't suggest that. In which case, we'll know we're getting closer when it starts smelling like a rotting corpse. Must you be so vulgar? It's just what I thought. Where I'm from, we keep such thoughts to ourselves. And where are you from? Right here, the capital. Hmm. I think you just called me a mannerless country bumpkin. This bitch. Right. Let's not waste any more time. Now they're arguing about what's in the jar. <laughs> hey, if you wanna, uh, if you wanna know, you can join me in here. No, My no, suggestion no. Is that we follow the vines. You know, actually, you know what? Wait, hold up, hold up. Uh, we're doing. <laughs> Wait, this is a horrible idea, by the way. <laughs> Yaku wants to join. Yaku, are you sure you want to join? Yaku, are you sure about this? Because if you if you're sure about this, I can't let you out until the uh, until everyone agrees to be let out. Yes. This yes. is a horrible idea. This is an actual horrible idea. Alright, Yagu, you asked for it. Sorry, Yagu. Uh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> you're inside the jar, too. Congrats, kids. You're in the jar. How does it feel? <laughs> this is so This is stupid. Okay, hold up. There, there. We're gonna. Th th there. Now you're in the jar, too. Look what you did. Don't blame me. 
Wait, this taste is too familiar and not milk familiar. You done huh? goofed. You done goofed. <laughs> I don't want to cry. You done goofed. <laughs> <Not goofy. laughs> don't ask why we have more than one jar. <laughs> Here's the thing, okay. guys. For you remember that I'm right underneath you, which means it's a hot tub. Mmm, deep fried. Mmm. It's more like boiled. <laughs> okay. Suggestion. Follow the vines. What do you suggest? Follow the vines. Let's just follow the vines then. Then we are in agreement. Why do we have more than one jar? One of them is pyres, the other is readables. I was told to share, okay? <laughs> yeah, I don't think there is much else we could do right now. I'm glad we are on the same page after all. <laughs> Nine other, neither of them are my jars. <laughs> They're not my jars. Wait till, she, wait till you see her hidden jar, anyway. I do have a hidden jar. Yeah, it's a pickling jar. No. It's wood chips. Oh. You're pickling your wood chips? God damn. We follow the vines for quite a while, going up and downstairs until I am completely lost. Sylvester seems to know what he's doing, so I'm glad he's here, even though I get this looming sense of inferiority. Whoa, that's not a door that should be there. This. What other Nemle games? We've gone, uh, of course, Andy and Lele is the first one we ever did that basically got us onto this path of Nemle games. <laughs> good no, good no. <laughs> and attracted most of you to this channel. Uh, the other is No Good Noel. We we done with the amazing T who is currently in the chat. T, we love you. Actually, let me give you a shout out real quick. Please be a funny clip. Please be the funny. Oh, I, wait, don't, I, I don't. I don't have. I don't have, have. I don't have. I don't have clip plays. Again, I was busy. I'll send you the link for it. Yeah, yeah, you later. can do that. Thanks, we'll do this Snuggies. afterwards. Oh, thanks, Snuggies. Uh, butter half, butter half, butter half. Uh, we'll see, Lumafau. Th this, this, um, this week is pretty packed already, uh, in which I will talk about later. What the F? Please, Marion. What the fantastical door this is! So weird! It most certainly is. Whatever's inside must be the cause of all these vines. <sighs> what is it? Do you hear that? Uh, I don't hear anything out of the unusual. It is almost like lamentation. Whatever that sounds like. What a sad tune. Why is Pyre in a- No, don't- Ajax, no! No! <laughs> Ajax, you're also in the jar. I don't know what you're talking about. God damn it, all of you. You know what? Screw it, screw it, screw it, screw it, screw it, screw it. Join the jar. Join the jar. I am not Join going in that jar. fucking jar. Join the jar. Wait, what the heck? Revolt, everybody. Make her join the jar. I will not join the jar. I let you out of the jar, Pyre. Okay. Wait, what? Whoopsies. Is this what an MLP feels like? Okay, I have let Pyre out of the jar for one reason and one reason only. What is the, what is the reason? So that they can join you in it. Both of you, but oh. you're, you're, all of you are going in the jar. Don't ask why Pyre is submerged in it. Hey Pyre, say something for the people. There you go, you're back up. And he's going back down. And we're gonna keep him above water level, just right there. <coughs> we're just gonna keep him slightly above water level, everybody. And we're gonna, we're gonna get all of you. <laughs> the dude is drowning. <laughs> now listen, he's fine. See, he's completely fine. He's fine. He's fine. He's fine. 
Ajax said Pyre Whimper audio. No! Stop it! No! What is this becoming? All right, we're stopping this right now. This is why you guys are in the jar too. Why are you into whimpering? I don't know, Nekomi. Why are they into it, chat? <laughs> These are... Nekomi, you are all basically children listening around the fire, which is me, to listen to a story. And for some reason, all of you decided to jump into a jar while you're doing it. I'm you put so me in here. medicated right now. Hey, Jax, please don't say anything you shouldn't. You, you put me in here, you bastard. I didn't jump in. It's your jar. You put me in here regardless. Right. I don't think Sylvester's hearing things. Maybe music boxes just have better ears than me. We must find a way to open this door. Oh, shit! Come on, you can't- we can't not use that option. We can't <laughs> not use that option. <laughs> Burn in holy fire! Burn in holy fire. You will not set fire to anything. But- come on! Whatever is in there would be trapped inside. Do you want to quite possibly burn down our only clues to finding the king? Or even the castle itself? And us? Aren't you made of wood of all things? Well, yeah. What a thing to suggest. I can't believe you. It was a joke, dude. Chill out. Was it? No. <sighs> Let's take a moment to think about this. Casper, I choose you, actually. <laughs> All right. Casper. Even though I try, I don't have any ideas. So my mom stops- my, my mom, yeah. My mind my stops mom. trying and starts wandering, wandering about. What are bunnies doing? <sighs> you guys are oh, getting an crap. inordinate- you guys are getting an inordinate- uh, fire in whimper in audio. Ah, <laughs> oh, crap. I fell asleep. Who the fuck is Annette? That's you, I guess. Annette. Annette is... No, Annette is the bunny's name. I thought her... No, her name is Bunny. Wait, who's Annette? Oh, Annette, I guess this is me. Marion? Oh, crap. Could you... Hello there. She's given a vibe. Hold up. Let me get the let me get the voice for this vibe. Ahem, ahem. ASMR pirate drowning in a jar. Stop calling it that. Stop calling it that jar. Chad, do you guys want to be let out of the jar? I'll let you out of the jar if you ask nicely. <laughs> I'm gonna sign up for this. Do you want to be let out of the jar? Yes, Yago. Yes, Yago. What? It's Ajax. <laughs> Why was he in the jar? Everyone's in the jar. Everyone really is in the jar. Except me. <laughs> Yeah. Have you come so far to be stricken with cowardice? Get me out and you get a gifted get sub? Get a gifted sub? Hey, yo! <laughs> I mean, is that selling out? Those puppy I... dog eyes aren't gonna work too. We know how evil you are, especially with Rodney. I mean, it'll work for me because I like uh, T is my friend, so. You stay in there. Have you come so far to be stricken with cowardice? All right, you're getting read out, you're getting get let out of the jar for two reasons: one, because T is a good friend, and two, because Max said so. <laughs> as much Coward. as I don't want to do things for money, I'm putting a kid through college. Okay, I'm putting a child. They're not a child anymore. I'm putting a child through college. <laughs> yes, you are being let out, Nekomi. Don't worry. I don't know about y'all, but your human education is for some reason really expensive. Put me back in, Ajax said, let me in. <laughs> no, I will not. I will do no such thing. By the way, I just need to do something real quick. Hey kids, wanna see a dead body? Guess what I uh, had to do. Guess what I had idiot. to do. You fucking idiot. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Yagu said put you back in. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but Max is stronger than you guys. He has money. That's true. <laughs> Hello there. You know readable. Oh Read, readable. Get again in here. G gift her a game so that everybody goes back. In no, the no, 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 no. Nobody's giving me any money. 
I'd rather you guys just direct it to the throne rather than Twitch, because Twitch takes a cut. <laughs> this is pay just... to win. Oh, is today? Oh, shit! The coffin of Andy and Lele's first anniversary! Yippee! Good for them! Honestly, for the dev team, for Namle, good for them. In terms of, like, the game's success, good for them. As for the game's reception, uh... <laughs> it depends on who's asking. Uh, what's the game flex? This is no, this is uh, no, what do you mean? No, T. This is Jack in a Castle, another Nemlay game. It's a, it's a little, it's a, it's another visual novel we got going on. By the way, I should shout all of these people out. Mr. Flex is being shouted out. A shout out for Flex. A shout out for I hope Saddam because before they go away. I, sh I already shouted out T. Okay, Saddam already lurked. When Pyre is already clickable over there. Who are you? Oh, well. right, let me, uh, tag. <clears throat> I accidentally sleepwalked in here. Honest. <laughs> that is that's that's actually really good. <laughs> really good? What do you mean? That's a really good excuse. I sleepwalked in here. Should we buy our own jar in exchange? Listen. So if I need three Nemli, yes, only three Nemli games so far. Slept walk in here, honest. Intruder, guards, guards. Oops. What's wrong? We should call it a day. But the door. Longer we stay, the higher our chances of getting caught. We'll continue tomorrow. Would you mind escorting Bunny out? Okay. If Bunny's alive, we find an exit for Sylvester and I return back to my room. Would Bunny's you... dead! Thank Imagine we just you find are, Bunny Marian. dead. Uh, yeah? You should check your belongings. A thief had snuck into your room. Oh, no. Indeed, but we've captured the scum. Jack will decide what to do with him. But forget about that for now. I need your help in the kitchen. I don't think I can refuse. Now you're cooking. Let her cook! Let me cook! I spend the- wait, let me- let me take my rightful place- This is the kitchen, so I shall take my rightful place as cooking under the pot. Let me just- let me just- Ah! 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 Okay, I've cooked. And now I shall return back to our little fire. Hello, everybody. Oh shit, Vinsu! Kamusta? It's been so long, my guy. Hello. You also deserve a <laughs> shout out because you for, I haven't seen you in a long time. I hope you're well. How's the new season going for you, buddy? Of course, the last thing you played is Siege. <laughs> <laughs> Benley's big three is Coffin of Enemy, No Go, No Good to Well, and Better Half. We haven't. Sh we've done two out of three of those. Better Half, we have not. We decided to go with this first because it was requested by our own Lemma Fow. Thank you, Lemma Fow. Permission for me and Ajax to be put back in the jar? Here's the thing, Yagu. I can't put you back in the jar without putting everyone else back in the jar. And not everyone wants to go back in the jar. Cowardice. Cal, can we go back in the jar? Should I is there how do you how do you start a poll? How do you start uh, a poll? I think mods can do it, but but you have to go into like the stream set, uh, in, in your dashboard. Damn, Max actually gifted subs. Oh, thanks for the thanks. sub to TV, Max. Thank you, Max. Damn, I thought you were kidding. You really didn't have to do that. Oh man, thank you so much though. How do we? How do you pull? I'm gonna create a poll. Fine. Didn't want to do it this way. Check your steep. Wait, what? Readable. You better not. You better not. Readable, you better freaking not. You son of a bitch! Readable! And what if I decline the gift, my guy, huh? What are you gonna do? What if I decline the gift, huh? What are you gonna do? <laughs> Readable gave me a whole ass gift, like a whole ass game on Steam. 
Lord have mercy on ourselves. You know what? Fine, fine. This is what we're gonna do instead, since you guys are so eager for this goddamn jar. You see this second jar? We're gonna create this second jar. Whoever wants to go in the jar, say so right now, and your name will go in the goddamn jar. Well, you're doing that, let me go to the restroom. <laughs> Whoever wants to get in the jar, you're gonna get in the jar. Now say if you want to be in the jar or not. Okay, readable is going in the jar. Ajax and Yagu are going in the jar. Who's we? I don't know. <laughs> Max, thank you so much. Come on, man. Please. Save your money on something more important. Like, I don't know, food or something. I know you humans need that shit. All right, who- No, no, you don't have to go in the jar, Nekubi, if you don't want to. The besties are back in the jar. And you know what? Just to make it worse, I'll put it in- I'll put it as you belong. Ajax. Yagu. Readable. Who else is going in the jar, kids? I'm back. Okay, who else is going in the jar? Who else is going in the jar? Who Aww. else is going in put, the jar? Put tea in the jar. Tea is not going in the jar. Go back to your origins. Max, you're not going in the jar. You don't have to. I mean, you say tea isn't going in the jar, right? But did you hear that tea said you're a dummy, dumb, dumb, dummy, dumb, dumb, dumb? I don't dummy, believe dumb? you. Tea, did you actually say these words? I don't believe I don't believe I them. never lie. I don't believe him. T, T, tell me, my good friend T, who I trust, did you actually say these words? Look, if there's one thing I am, uh, I do. It's I never lie. All right, Except Ajax, Yago, and Readable the are in the are in the jar. You guys are in the jar. Are you happy? You know what? I, I'm just gonna I'm gonna put you in the jar with him. There you go. Oh, at least. <laughs> uh. Great, now you guys have a roommate, and it's Pyre. Hello. Kissing the homies! <laughs> I hate all of you so much. <laughs> this is what my why stream did... has turned into. Why, why did Twitch censor dummy dum dum? I don't know. Hush, thank you. It, it, it ain't gay to kiss the homies. <laughs> Y'all gonna share the rent? In my chat, man. I, okay. I own this home, huh? I got a mortgage on and we're good, Chief. Oh my god. You gotta share the rent. It's free in the grove. I hope Bunny's alright, not disemboweled somewhere. I don't get much sleep. If Bunny doesn't keep his mouth shut, we'll be in trouble. I need to tell Sylvester. After lunch, I tell Lynette I'm gonna take a small break. Then I go see if Sylvester is at the secret entrance. It doesn't seem that he's here at all, though. Uh... Sylvester is speaking through a hole in the ceiling. Marion, come here. Uh, how? Climb out the window and use the vines to get to the roof. What happened to not touching the vines? That doesn't sound dangerous at all. I'm sure you'll die from the fall. Uh. Uh, that wasn't how I meant to say that. I meant if you do fall, you won't be injured or paralyzed <laughs> for life. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> You'll have a swift death. Gee, thanks. I don't know how that's supposed to reassure me, but thanks. Please, just get up here. Someone will notice you talking to the walls. Excuse you, I'm talking to the ceiling. I climb up to the roof and manage to not die in the process. I couldn't find Bunny anywhere. Did he get caught? I did see this, Nekomi. Yeah, no, usually it has a lot of these, like, very, very, um, dark subject matters, which is honestly a discussion for a different day. I've actually, <laughs> I've actually had uh, the idea of maybe doing, uh, maybe doing a video on Andy and Lele, not like a VOD, I mean like a video on Andy and Lele or Nemli Games in general with the themes, with these themes and asking basically, is it okay for these games to even be 
a thing. Because uh, obviously the answer will vary. Because you know, a lot of people are angry about the fact that games like this exist, right? Like, oh my gosh, this is horrible because this game involves this themes and th these themes, etc., etc. So like, I mean, does it? Hmm. Absolutely, it's thing. a it's fiction. First of all, L literally, right? Like it, it it's not whether or not. It, it, it exists is good or bad. It's whether yeah, yeah, yeah. it's pro portrayed as good or bad. That's yeah, whether what it's portrayed as good or bad, and whether or not it's like, it's there's always factors to a game, which we'll call a piece of art here. There's always factors to art in which there is the intention of the artists, the art itself, and then the interpretation of the people, right, and how it's received by the people. So that's kind of what I wanted to do. If ever I wanted to do a video on games, on Nemle games that involve such dark subject matters or taboo subject matters, we'll see though. Bro has a different type of hey, 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 Yago. I don't know if that word is allowed. We don't know what Nemle is, so we they them. Yeah, no, we mostly use they them. I, bro, I'm pretty sure is also technically <laughs> gender neutral. I call T bro. How dare you? <sighs> I suppose we'll just leave him there for now. By the way, anyone else who misbehaves is gonna end up in the jar. Hello. Anyhow, now that Bunny has been caught, I'll assume the security has been tightened. Sneaking about won't get us anywhere but in jail. What should we do then? Also, should we not help Bunny? Don't worry about it, Chief. I'm sorry. I'll have to think about it. It's fine. Take your time. I'm sure you'll figure something out. That sounds like something Bunny would say. I... N no, it doesn't. I'm glad you have faith in me, but please don't stop using your own judgment. I won't. Good to hear it. We are in this together. Okay, I'm starting to think maybe Bunny was the better choice. Yeah. There you go, be a bastard. Thank you for your time. I'll see you soon. Do we ask or what? When? Where? Hmm? Sylvester seems taken aback. Well, I don't know exactly. And they're back to gambling. Hmm. <laughs> but sooner than later, in one place or another. Alright, that's not vague at all. Forgive me for being so vague. Fuck. <laughs> I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing you again. Me too. Oh, she has- they have a crush. You really are fond of chatting with me, aren't you? God. Anyway. <laughs> Take care, Marion. Sylvester climbs down to the garden with much more grace than I could ever imagine. Manage. You're, I return back to work. Mind... Yeah. Uh, you, so you, you do have to do with me. You, re you really are fond of chatting with me, aren't you? <laughs> readable, readable is going to get yelled at. Well, shit, that's the wrong... way. Wait, I, I, why did I do shout out? I meant to gamble all my brains dying. Also, you're not. Why do you have it so that non-mods can shout people out? I... You're... No, you're a mod. I'm a mod? You're no, a mod. Not. Yes, you are. Wait, no, that's I right! I... Hold yeah, wait, up! Why do you have it so that non-mods can shout people out? I did not know I had it that way. Let, Scott... You know what? My... <laughs> My brain dead moment actually helped. Yeah, no, your brain dead moment have helped. How the fuck? Am I crazy? Wait, am I crazy? Why didn't I know that? Crazy? I was crazy once. Shut it the hell up! How do I fix that, by the way? You have to go into Streamlabs itself and then change the, uh, what do you call this? Son you of have a change... nut! <laughs> you, okay. you have to change the permissions. Why is it like this? Because Streamlabs isn't made by o uh, by Twitch, so it's its own thing. Cool. How do I fix it? You you go into the Streamlabs web. Uh, you go I'm to there. The Streamlabs. I'm there. Okay. You go to the ch uh, the chat bot, and then you go to commands, and then you can set the uh, the permissions, S like how big, uh, what role you need. Son of a nut. I'm I'm keeping it PG. Son of a nut. PG, I'm in a fucking jar. What the hell you mean? And the jar is milk. <laughs> it's it, 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 it's milk. Club bot name We're command. Emily King. Shush. I'm keeping it PG. <laughs> the stream is not. <laughs> yeah. So go to Cloudbot and then go to uh, go to commands and then you can edit command. 
And then you can change permissions from everyone to whatever people. So I guess moderators and streamers. Why the fuck is this not? Why the fuck is this not? Uh, what's the term? Default. Hold yeah, why up. is it not default? Why? Is it it's because shout out isn't a default command. Right. How do I? How do I change? It, You're on the website, right? Uh, I'm on the website. On the right side. It's, it has Very a switch. Enough. On the right side, there's a pencil button. Oh my god. Look at that. I hate everybody. Like it takes to delete and then yeah, change I, permissions I could see from it. I could see it. Subs, yeah. mods. There we go. Confirmed. Oh. I fucking hate my own myself. Don't worry about it. There uh. you go. Can you check if everything? No, everything should be fine. The throne command is fine. The shout out, lurk game, Discord. Thank you, Mister Mister Pirato. Our turn back to work at the cook gives me an earful for taking such a long break. Kissing cool, the next. homies for the people who are in the jar kissing the homies. I'm yes. done with work. It's late enough that everyone is probably asleep. I think I'll go check on Bunny in the dungeons. Oh shit! It's Jack. Uh, hello? Nice to see you're still a useless sack of sh- Right, good evening, Jack. Hello. And what exactly is so good about it? Nothing, I guess. Nothing. The evening is just like you. By the way, Pyre, they're upset you're not kissing the homies. Mwah. Oh, God. Yeah, I kissed the homies. <laughs> Nothing good about it. Ah, uh, I'm pretty sure this is... There's nothing to be gained from this conversation, but what the hell is his deal? Ask. Uh, Jack? What? Aside from my general awfulness, what's wrong? I can't believe that stupid rabbit got in my castle. What am I playing Galeathos for? Galeathos. What am I paying you for? Uh, I'm a servant. The rabbit climbed up using the vines. If only I had servants capable of managing the garden. I don't think it's a problem with the garden. I know it isn't. But it's basically the same job. Just keep these things in check. By the way, to anyone who just came in, doesn't this guy look exactly like a more unhinged version of Pyre right here? Maybe in the jar unhinged. with you? <laughs> I'll do it. <sighs> yes. I'll leave it to you, Marion. Understood, sir. <sighs> Thank you. Huh? Maybe my staff isn't all entirely bad. Just most of it. And off he goes. That kind of scared me. Thought the investigation was done for. But maybe I won't be visiting Bunny after all. <laughs> Who knows if Jack decides to come back. By the way, Max has redeemed the hydrate. So go it's hydrate Max. yourself and I will go water a plant in your honor, Mr. Max Toshio. Max, I'm gonna name one of the trees in the grove after you because of how much you've basically funded VA's college fund. <laughs> Today is a pretty one. I wish I could go visit the marketplace. But Jack's outburst still makes me too wary to go. I know I haven't been a very good employee, but he hasn't been a good employer either. The guard is chopping off vines with all his might. He must have gotten told off too. Hi there, uh, guard. I really, really should remember his name by now, but... Hello, moron. Moron? <laughs> huh? Oh, no, 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 no. I am so sorry. I meant Morgan. That is still not my name, but I'll take it over, moron. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Do you need some help with the vines? That'd be... Uh, that would... Yeah, I'd like that. Sure. Why is a guard doing this vast... Why is a guard doing this anyway? Sorry. Why do you sound like uh, uh, Why do you sound like a fucking basic Wait, it's bitch? actually a thing? I meant this. This is going wonderfully. Do you have more, um, guardly duties to do? 
What do you mean? You know, like, um, gardening or, uh, gardening? Uh. Hmm. I'm gardening. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right. He deserves, he deserves to, okay. All right, all right. You deserve to go, you, you, okay, okay. Take a dip, take a dip, take a dip, take a dip. He's fine, don't worry, he's fine, he's fine, he's fine. Just tap the jar if it, if it's, if it gets too much. Tap the jar if it gets too much. Uh, you good? Hey, hey. You're already above the liquid. You've been above the liquid. What are you doing? Hey, Shin. Oh, there's Shin. I'm gonna shout out Shin real quick. Hi, Mr. Hadouken. As you can see, we're being cursed today. We are being cursed. Magnificent. We are both amazing social butterflies. I want to be blown away by the wind and never come back like an actual butterfly. It's, well, it's okay. We're short-staffed and, well, the rabbit snuck in using the vines. Oh, that's right! Uh, this is preemptive guarding. I get it. Yes, yes, mm. it's that guard ending. I get it. You know what? This was great thinking, dude. You're doing so good. Yes, thank you. I still would not call that a conversation. Or at least not a very good one. But I'm pleased with our progress. Is there a route for the guard? Because that's actually really cute. <laughs> guard route. Guard route. Chug, chug, chug. These two are relatable. Maybe one day we'll call each other by our real names, too. I'm thinking he's Goliath... G Goliathus? Goliathus? I don't know. What did Jack call him? Galileo. Galileo Galilei. <laughs> We make sure we cut off the biggest vines. It only hits me later. I'm probably making things harder for Sylvester, though. But I haven't heard anything from him. I hope he shows up soon. The days fly by as I help cook and clean. I'm making sure no one sees me taking any extra breaks, but I do take them because fuck this place. Good work today. You're a big help. I wish more toys were like you. She has no idea what she wished for. It's tough running this place understaffed. Sorry. <clears throat> uh. There's a guard route? Oh. Oh. What is it, Galiathos? It is Galiathos. So that's his name. Yes, I mean, no, no um. We, we're getting a new employee. Oh? Finally! For what? Who is it? Jack has hired himself a right-hand man. But Jack is the right-hand man. Uh, um, I, uh, I'm just here to let you know. Well, isn't that just great? One more mouth to manage, and here I got my hopes up. His name is Sylvester Sound. That He'll is a name! <laughs> work here, starting wait, tomorrow. Wait, wait. Marion Marionette, Sylvester Sound, and Galiathos Guard? How is, does, what the hell does Galiathos even mean? It's just the name! Sylvester doesn't oh. mean anything, it's just the name. Wait, the guard has a bunny. face? Okay, no spoilers. No spoilers. The guard is Tumblr's sexy man. That that means nothing. You do realize that in uh, that in Tumblr, they voted the number one Tumblr sexy man a dude who doesn't even have a face. Aha. Sylvester. That is all uh uh good day. And the guard stumps away. That means Jack wants us to make everything look all nice and neat for this new guy. But yeah, I'm actually curious. Did he do that for me too? <laughs> Goodness, no. Oh. A right-hand man is someone important who helps him manage everything. Jack likely wants to impress someone he's chosen for such a high position. 
Honestly, what is Jack thinking? He's not the king. How dare he act like he is? I listen hmm. to her rant about the missing king the rest of the day while we work. She doesn't take notice that I take some crackers for Bunny. Ah, uh, Bunny. Hi there. So she's not. Oh my goodness. It's food. Wait, have they not been feeding him? Bunny eats with all the elegance of a starving toy. Oh my god, they haven't been feeding him. Thanks, dear. You haven't given me anything but water. Ugh. Really? I should have brought you actual food then. My bad. I won't deny that, but I'm grateful for what I got. <sighs> it was just crackers, though. Just crackers? Someone didn't grow up hungry. I'll get you something better the next chance I get. Thank you, love. Uh, anyway, what's Sylvester's last name? Sound? Yeah, it's Sound, you know? He's like an aristocrat or something. Huh, I had no idea. No wonder he's such a... I shouldn't say anything. Bunny is his friend, it might upset him. Such an uppity, boring, pretentious little prick. Right? Never mind. Something like that. Anyway, I heard Sylvester is starting as Jack's right-hand man. Ooh, is that traitor? I sincerely doubt that what's going on. How do you get such a high position then, huh? I honestly have no idea. You really think he turned on us? No. It's Sylph. He's all stuck up and way too caught up in his own principles, you know? How should I know? I just met him recently. Ah, that's right. You don't know him, do you? I just said that. Oh, yeah. Sorry. My brain's a little fuzzy. Thanks for the follow, Bianca. Nice to know, the Blanca. You just followed Bianca. me now. I called her Bianca, okay. Blanca, you just followed me now. <laughs> hey, Blanca. Blanca, is this the first time? I'm a, that's that's funny. There you go, Blanca. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I really should get you some actual food. I steal some of today's leftover for Bunny. It's cold, but he doesn't mind. I fall asleep right now. I can't get four. If I fall asleep right now, I can still get four hours of sleep. Music. Marion. Oh shit! It is our Sylvester. Why on earth are you still awake? Uh, well, um, I was just uh, uh, I have clearly been blessed with the ability to talk my way out of any situation. Well, no matter. In fact, that's great. Meet my new right-hand man. My name is Sylvester Sound. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Nice to meet you. Sylvester will be helping me out from now on. You make sure he knows what he, uh, what's what around here. Understood. Also, fix him a room somewhere while you're at it. Now? It's midnight. Indeed it is. Don't you think Sylvester wants to go to bed soon? Alright. I'll leave you to it. My apologies, Marion. I'm showing up out of, uh, I'm showing up out of the blue like this. No worries. Me and Jack were drinking some wine to celebrate our partnership. We didn't notice the time. I told you, don't worry about it. I wasn't even sleeping or anything. I suppose. <laughs> yes, Blanca, forgive me. Come on, let's go find you. There's someone in the grove. Well, there's a few people in the grove named Bianca, so it's a common name here, actually. Forgive me. Hmm. Nice, nice room. Would this be fine? Absolutely. Sylvester helped me clean the room, even though he really shouldn't have to. I guess he wants to go to sleep before dawn. So, if you don't mind me asking... Yes? How did you manage to get hired so fast, and in such a position? It seems Jack really enjoys the music for my orchestra. I've occasionally chatted with him after a show. Wait! You're famous! I had no idea! 
dawns on me how little I know of Sylvester in general, even though we're on a secret mission together. <laughs> I'm not. Our music is. Anyhow, Jack was at our concert the other day, so I simply invited him for a drink. I told him it'd be nice to play in a castle one day. Somehow, that conversation went from me being invited to a play, uh, to play, to me becoming his right-hand man. You must have a way with words. I believe I just happened to be on his good side by default. Huh. Not to mention my family's high status. Right, that would help. Although there are some bad apples in our family tree. Huh? I hope you'll find some excuse to visit me after your shift. Okay. Or before, if that's better. I'll try. Good. I'll see you tomorrow, Marion. Wait. Oh, you want to wait or you want I'm not sure I should wander around so much. Someone's gonna notice. I believe you'll be fine. <sighs> You've done well so far. Still, should you not show up after uh, show up for a while, I'll come see you myself. How forceful. Please understand, this is for the sake of Toy Boxian. Toy Boxian. I I thought that maybe Toy Box was the name of the of the of this of the castle. No, 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 of the kingdom. And Toy Boxian was the term for someone who's from there. But no, Toy, Bo Toy Boxian is the actual name of the yes. of the place. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I know. But I'll admit I might just want to see you. Mm. Huh? Yes, what? dear Marion, I simply can't take my eyes off you. No, something's wrong. Something's off. I don't believe this. What? <laughs> you might, You just might ruin oh, our plan. Oh, oh, that's what he meant. Ah, uh, just say that <laughs> in the first place. <laughs> Man. I really must be tired to joke around like this. You say our goodnights and I return to my room, you prick. I get to sleep for a few more hours. Me, 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 me. I'm telling you, if we're gonna hire more people, it should be servants. I still can't believe. Good morning. Oh, good, good morning, Jack. And... Sylvester, pleased to make your acquaintance. <gasps> oh, the, the pleasure is all mine. Please call me darling. I mean, Annette. I, Annette. As you wish, Annette, darling. Oh! <laughs> now get back to work. I'm here to ju uh, I'm just- uh, I'm here just to show Sylvester around. CL Phantom Hive, look at us. Oh, CL really? I see. I mean, no, kind of. Basically, uh -huh. I called him- I called him the protagonist from Persona 3, actually. Is he- Because of the hair. Makoto Yuki. Orpheus. Orpheus. You're, are you doing the- are you doing the- Thanatos. Are you doing the Alex Lee or are you doing the Yuri Lowenthal? I'm just going mid-range, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Can I come? Why would you want to? Makoto is cuter. It's just that you never really showed me around. Did I not? No. If that's the case, I don't see why not. Fine. Since Sylvester says so. How obedient. Jack takes us around various areas. I remember me and Sylvester walking here earlier. But we both act like we've never seen any of it before. Jack rambles on and on about everything. It feels like forever and there's not a hint of the king anywhere. Ta-da! Here we are! So he just takes us here. No qualms. Oh, yeah. This place! We couldn't get past that door earlier. Now this last room... I'm second guessing whether to show you or not. This is it. All the answers should be behind this door. Probably. We can come back another time, should you want to think about it some more. What is he saying? We have to get in there! Tired of me, are you? Not at all. It's been the most interesting tour. Uh, it has? Well, alright. I'll show you. But only because I'm nice. Yeah, yeah, shook your ego later. Just open the goddamn door. And since you're going to be my right-hand man, you need to know. Need to know what? 
Open the door, damn you! And Marion? Uh, yes, what? Don't you have work to do? No, 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 no! Right, of course. Oh man, I really wanted to see. I quickly glanced at Sylvester, but he's not looking my way. Is he ignoring me? Whatever's in that room, it has to be important, no doubts. I'm sure Sylvester will tell me all about it later. Won't he? You really sound like Gregory. I'm sorry, alright? It's my default young boy voice. <laughs> Let me just... I go back to the kitchen like a good worker. Annette is cooking happily. That Sylvester is such a good man. <laughs> uh, What's the choice here, Cal? Sure, why not? He sure is. He thinks so too. The difference between Jack and Sylvester is like a night and day. Right? I hope Sylvester makes a proper king out of Jack. You mean until the real king returns. I'm sorry, it's, it's just been so long already. Do you believe the king will actually be back? I don't know. I, I hope he will. Yes, me too. Well, in either case, Mr. Sound here. With Mr. Sound here, things are looking up. The smell of burnt food fills the room. Oh, shoot! I forgot about that. No, no, Before. no! And I was supposed to impress Sylvester with my cooking, too. Today's dinner is well done. Extremely, Extremely. well done. Tasty. Sylvester told me to try and visit him at night. Good evening, Marion. Glad you made it here. Jack sure likes you. Good manners are everything. Jack especially seems to appreciate them. Not when I do it. Perhaps your delivery is lacking. Lacking in what? Pretentiousness. Ah, so he's self-aware. Ha! <laughs> Why, Marion? Your smile is so precious. Uh, huh? See? It works on you, too. It did not. <laughs> Let's get back to the matter at hand. In that room. <sighs> Sylvester? For now, let me just say, the king is alive. Oh, shit! What? That's great! Yes, it is good news. You don't look too happy, though. I'm sorry. I need to ask Jack some more questions before I can fully explain the situation. Well, okay. I wish he'd just come out and say what was inside, but okay. Thank you for visiting me. That's what we agreed on. Still, it means a lot to me that you follow through with our plans. No problem. You are a good doll. Uh, thanks. You're a good music box. If you say so. <sighs> Despite his calm and polite appearance, I get the feeling Sylvester is sad. Sylvester? Yes? Are you okay? I am fine. Thank you for asking. How about you, Marion? How are you? Uh, small talk it is, then. I get the hint. He's not gonna tell me anything. I'm good, just a bit tired. Yes, it is rather late. Let's continue our chat another time. Yeah. We say our goodnights and I leave. I couldn't sleep. I kept wondering about the king. If he's alive, why isn't he here? Is he in that room? Why was Sylvester being so secretive about it? We're supposed to be in this together. Ugh, it's not like I'm mad at him. It's just... I wish he'd tell me what he found out about the king. Okay, okay, enough. I'm just going around in circles. It's too early to go to work, but it'd be a good chance to visit Bunny. Aha! Uh -huh. Bunny is still sleeping. Let's wake him up. Who cares? He can sleep all day anyway. Bunny! What? What's happening? Oh, it's just you. What is it, dear? Sylvester started working here now. What? Sylv this and Sylv that. Thanks for the status update. But do you have anything on the king? Well, Sylvester found something out, but won't tell me yet. Suspicious. He's usually pretty willing to exchange information. Has he visited you? 
Nope. Why? Just wondering. Maybe Sylvester doesn't want Bunny to know anything. Maybe he's worried Bunny would break his cover by accident or something. Hmm. I hope that's not the reason he doesn't share information with me. Say, is that food for me? Oh, yeah. Uh, here you go. Thank you. Munch, 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 munch. I can't focus at all. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Chill, 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 bro. You're gonna, you're gonna, yeah. calm down, calm down. Drink some water, drink some water. Here, here, here. You, you can drink what's in this jar. Okay. Wait. Okay. <laughs> Oh, he's going down. He's going down. He's going down. <laughs> I spilled so much water on myself doing that noise. By the way, uh <laughs> Yes. I'm reading I'm reading the I'm reading the chat right now. Love a foul bruh. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanna know what's in the goddamn room. Oh no. What's wrong? I messed up again. Um, I tried this recipe I thought Sylvester would like, but it was my first time, and this looks so bad. You're trying too hard. Yeah, no. You're trying too hard. You're trying too hard. I am, but I really want him to like my cooking. I think your regular cooking is great, but it's not fantastic. Fantastic, like Mr. Sound. You've seen him, like, mm. twice. Shush you. Let me have this. But, since the dinner failed, I'll cook up something better. Are you sure you have the time? Well, it might be a little late, but it'll be worth it. I'll let everyone know. Okay, but don't tell them it's my fault! Okay, okay. Excuse me. Sylvester and Jack are sitting around a pile of papers and books. It looks like an important strategy meeting, only it's taking place on the floor. What is it? Dinner will be late, so here's some tea and biscuits for now. Thank you kindly. Yeah, yeah. If that was everything. I'm thrown out already? Come on! Yes, goodbye. I close the door and make sure I walk down a few steps extra loud, then I carefully climb back up as quietly as I can. Try as I might, I can't actually hear a thing through the door. Cause this door thick. That is visit. Oh <laughs> shit. Why did he open the door? They're supposed to be drinking tea. Uh Um What's wrong? Actually, I forgot to mention one more thing. Sylvester closes the door before Jack sees me. Oh thank god, I leave at once. Sylvester looked pretty pissed. Uh... He's trying to learn, baby. Yeah, no. He isn't telling me everything. I'm here on my own mission. Of course I won't just sit and wait. Pyre the Sloppenheimer? No, 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 no. I decide not to visit Sylvester tonight because he's probably angry at me. Uh, come in? And instead, he decides to visit me. <laughs> good evening, Marion. This doesn't look good at all. He's angry. He's totally angry. Good evening. <sighs> mm. Do you not trust me? No. I mean, no, that's not it. I do. I do trust you. But... <sighs> please understand this. Well, uh, please understand. This will take time. I will let, I will you, let know... you know everything oh, when sorry. the time is right. Sloppenheimer, it's a, it's a, it's a, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, Nekumi. Yeah. Please do not try to advance this situation on your own. You know what? Yeah, sure. Why not? I get it. I'm sorry. But this isn't how I imagined it. I wanted mm -hmm. to find the king. <sighs> I understand. Huh? I'm sorry. This must be frustrating for you. You're still willing to work with me. I would like to tell you something. Of course. What is it? You have to promise me not to act on your own anymore. And you have to promise you'll trust my way of handling things. I promise. Hmm. Uh. I found the king. And as I've said earlier, he is alive. 
Why is Pyre in a jar? Pyre is in a jar with his homies. Pyre, kiss the homies real quick. Mwah. There you go. No, it is not. Please don't say that, Lava Fowl. Oh my god. It's fine. It's fine. Where is he? Is he okay? Marion. Right. Okay. Go on. The king is kept asleep. I stopped myself from launching another set of questions. Note, kept asleep. By Jack? Oh, okay. He is... His majesty is ill. Jack believes he'll recover with some rest. What kind of illness is it? An illness of the mind. Oh shit, he's gone crazy. Or perhaps in his heart. That's... What kind of vague bullshit? I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Do, do you not want to hear about it after all? Sorry, yes, I do. I do. That's just that if he's ill, shouldn't we all know about it? The best doctors should come and help his majesty. Yes, that is the thing, Marion. We can't tell the other toys. And that is because of the vines. Huh? <sighs> I'm sorry, Marion. Can I tell you this some other time? Well, I'd like for you to tell me now. I know. Please be patient. I'm still processing the information myself. I want to collect my thoughts and present them to you clearly. Like I give a crap if his presentation is clear. I just want to know what's going on. But if I push it now, he might not tell me anything anymore. All right, I understand. Really? Yeah, you can tell me later. It's almost morning already anyway. Thank you, Marion. I'm being a little unreasonable, so your patience is truly appreciated. It's fine, just get your thoughts in order. I can wait another day or two or ten or a lifetime, why not? Thank you. You, you are a doll, dumbass. You don't age until tomorrow. I don't Good think night. any of us age. I don't know about that, Chief. There he goes, and I'm left wondering what the hell I just heard. The king is sick, but it's a secret. What, is it something contagious? Are the vines related? Are they poisonous? Is the king turning into a jungle? What? George of the jungle, baby. I hate you so much. Why doesn't he just tell me? Now I can't sleep at all. <sighs> I, I was sent to buy some spices. They're usually delivered into the castle in big packages, but the cook has been messing around with her cooking so much that we've needed them. What the hell am I looking what at? <laughs> Why is Jack still playing the king? I don't even care if the king is missing anymore. I just someone. I just want someone proper in charge. I'm embarrassed of what the other countries must think of us. Our king is a bloody clown. If it were up to me, we'd vote on a new king. You don't vote for kings, you fucking morons. Do any of these people do anything but complain? Oh, an actual woman! No, wait! This is the beatboxer! That's just her... That, that, I was supposed to say that's his sister. <laughs> that's his wife. It's the beatboxer. I thought this a girl. Okay, uh, what's the voice for this? I'm thinking... Ashley. I hate Ashley. Okay, fine. I'm pulling out. I'm pulling out Ashley's voice for this. You know what? I'll give the kids a fun fact. Fun fact for you kids. In order for me to remember Ashley's voice, I have to remember a particular line, and I have to say that line in the exact tone that she say said it in. I'm not gonna <laughs> shut up. Cow. Shut up. You can't pay me enough to say that line. But yeah, uh, there is a line I have to say that. A lot of you might know, actually. Shut up, Mama Fowl. Thank you. Thank you, Blanca. She has a ponytail. She does have a ponytail, so I'm gonna mute real quick so that I can get the character in. Oh, God. Excuse You're me, welcome, sir. Sweetheart. I hate you so much. <laughs> I hate you so much. You knew the exact moment I had muted. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what a pretty woman. Uh, yeah? You look like a brave young man who knows left from right. I don't, but okay. Uh, what do you want? You should join- no. Dude, at least let me finish. I'm looking for toys to join our cause. We're going to march to the castle and demand the truth about our missing king. That's good luck. Good luck. 
Won't you join? I can see you're troubled too, you know. I have to go. I understand. Go ahead and sleep on it. I'll wait. Don't hold your breath. I... It's not that I disagree with her. I believe me and Sylvester can figure out a better solution, though. At least once Sylvester finally fills me in on the situation. But hey, when you change your mind, you'll find me right here. I buy my spices and get back to the castle. No! 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 I'm not saying it. Hey, yes, the cook is a woman. Annette is a woman. Hi there. Hello, Mr. Marionette. I keep forgetting that this is a, this is a sir. Okay. Right. Hello, Mr. Sound. Tonight, it is supposedly a wonderfully co a clear sky. Take a look if you're having trouble sleeping. Sounds good. Yes. Have a nice day. It's almost like a secret date when he puts it that way. I bring the spices to the kitchen and work for the rest of the day. The sky isn't especially clear or wonderful, but here I am anyway. Thank you for coming. Of course. I've collected my thoughts. I'm willing to tell you what I know. However, once you learn the truth, I doubt you can yeah, rest Marianne's easy a dude. afterwards. Marion's a dude. That's why earlier he had the Gregory voice. But then I yes. realized a, a more gender neutral is easier, so that's why we're talking in this range. I've never been good at sleeping anyway. <laughs> Are you sure? It's quite sad what is going on. Just spit it out. Very well. I can't discuss this here, nor in the castle. Please, follow me. Where are we going, Ben? We walk across the town. We enter a fancy-looking building. Welcome to my pad, bitch. This is your pad? We're in- what? what uh, yo, MTV Cribs? We in LA, motherfucker. Yes. I'm so jealous. Dude, this place is awesome. Thank you. I made it out of the hood, yo. No. <laughs> okay, that's where that stops. That's where that bit stops. That was the whitest thing you've ever said. <laughs> that's where Let's that continue. bit stops. That was so white. Let's continue our conversation. Oh, yeah, that. I will cut to the chase. His <laughs> Majesty wants to destroy the kingdom. Huh? Exactly! Huh? <laughs> the vines around the castle come from his heart. Uh, someone said hydrate. The... Okay. Thanks, Nuggies. You didn't hear Pyre go, Yo, this is my crib, yo? That was so... <laughs> that was so tri- <laughs> We we jokingly call Pyre a white boy. Interesting. Forgive me, Nekomi. There. <clears throat> Forgive me if Let's that's see. how that comes out, Nekomi, but it's not necessarily that. It's more so that I suppose that is on me for one for enforcing types of stereotypes as well. No, Pyre is not white. I'm not white. <laughs> Pyre is not white. Neither of us are white. I'm blue, and he's Filipino. <laughs> <laughs> but no, Nekomi, that was not the intention, neither is that usually the meaning I would hear conscribed to that, but forgive me if that is the way that comes off to you. But I will say this, uh, yes, uh, what we mean by that is more so that, yeah, it sounds like the stereotypical... Um, it sounds like the stereotypical way that someone tries to copy, like, Afro-American slang. And like in a less than uh, in a in in a in a, in a more like suburban white um, accent, I suppose is the thing. But yeah, no, that was not the intent. Forty three days to change my name to Gamer Fart. You're gonna change your name back to Gamer Fart? Don't do it. <laughs> Don't do it. All right. Um, oh, we skipped it. Oh, well, that's fine. All right. It is the it is the king reaching out to corrupt this uh, corrupt the land. The whole castle has been warped because of his majesty's desire to ruin it all. Oh my god. Jack has the king under a sleeping spell. Should the king awaken, there would be no stopping him. So basically, the king has a nuke in the form of himself. Yes. yes. Or the king is a nuke. But he's the king. Why would he want to ruin his own land? 
Let me put it this way. He has, he has come to hate this world so much, he'd rather see it all disappear. Has he gone crazy? I suppose. King is the bomb, basically. He's dangerous. Why isn't he locked up then? You could say, him being forced to sleep is keeping him locked up. But I don't believe the spell can keep him asleep forever. As you've seen, the vines keep on growing. <sighs> what should we do? That is what me and Jack are trying to figure out. Hmm. Hmm. This is too sudden. Do you wish I hadn't told you? I don't care that it's scary. I wanted to know what's going on, and I don't regret finding that out. Thank you for telling me. I see. King's mom is Oppenheimer. His mom? <laughs> I see. It's because he's the bomb. Actually. This, this goes without saying, but I will just say this. I will say it just in case. I am become death destroyer of worlds. Do not tell anyone what I just told you. Especially Bunny. Yeah, I'm guessing that's like a crucial choice. Hmm. This information must not leak. The toys would rush into the wrong decisions. Yeah, but why did you tell me then? <laughs> hmm. Perhaps I needed to get it off my chest. Yikes. Jack too must have felt that way and hired me. It is a heavy secret to hold. So, Jack is actually protecting everybody. He's not actually crazy. Hey. Crazy? I was crazy once. Stop! I'm sorry to have burned Dear you Dear Lord! It. Ugh. That is a lot to take in, isn't it? Yeah, I think I need some time to wrap my head around it. I will listen if you need me to. Thanks. Are we... Are we gonna die? Everyone da- Blech. Everyone dies, Marion. No, I mean like tomorrow. The day after tomorrow? Soon. If the king awakens, yes. I don't believe there is anything that can be done. Can't we kill the king? Jack doesn't want that. Oh. Uh. But the king is dangerous. Yes. His majesty is growing more and more resistant to the sleeping spell. What's the question, Negami? I think Negami was, uh, was question marking the Oppenheimer joke. Ah, yes. Once the spell can no longer keep him asleep, there is no way to stop him. If we plan to stop the king, it must be now. However, if we harm the king, Jack might very well execute us. This is a great- this is an ethical dilemma for sure. So if it becomes a matter of which death would you prefer? Man. I don't believe we can arrive at any sort of solution tonight. But rest assured, I'm doing my best trying to find a way out of this. Yeah. Will you be alright? Oh! Uh... What are we thinking? What are we thinking? What are we thinking? Do you want a romantic man? Do we do try? We no, here's the thing. I feel like every trace we've made so far has been towards him. Fuck it. Love about Love about says percent. hug. Hug. Oh, hug. I just need a hug. What a coincidence. I just happen Aww. to have a spare. Smooth. You do? He's smooth with it. Oh damn! There's art. There you go. Right here. Aww. Did it help? Maybe a little. <laughs> Guys, they hugged! They hugged! Try to get some sleep, Marion. Yeah, you too. I stare at the ceiling for the rest of the night, imagining my certain doom. The king has to die. I'll kill him- No, wait, that is not what we agreed to! <laughs> wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm wait, sorry, wait. you have to kill him now! I won't tell Sylvester, though. I'll run away to a place where Jack can't have me killed. There's no way I can kill the king and get off the hook, is there? I can't worry about the king today, though. I mean, I can, but I don't want the others asking me why I'm down. I'll be brave. Sylvester is doing his best, too. Galeathos ah, is Gale reading Gale the newspaper. Anything interesting? Uh. Uh. <laughs> Hello, Morticiana. No spoilers! 
Don't make me have to ban you, Lumafow. You you behaving. How is that even anything close to my name anymore? Fire. Any good news? That's you. <laughs> Lady hairdresser loves the pink lemonade from a local bar. Uh, who? A lady hairdresser. She's the most famous makeup doll in the, in the land. Uh, and she likes our lemonade. Amazing. Oh, uh, okay. Who cares? We're all gonna die! Also, the orchestra has re replaced Sylvester's sound with some other music box. What? Who? Who cares? Uh, mm. It seems our interests do not align. But man, Sylvester got replaced. I guess it makes sense now that he's working here. He can't possibly hold two full-time jobs. Still, it's a little sad. Technically, there's a sibling dynamic. Stop. I mean, this would... Wait, no, there is no sibling dynamic, is there? There is no, no sibling dynamic. I forgot, that's not his sister, that's, that's his not girl. His... It's not his girl either, he just said that they were part of a set. Well, they danced. Well, yeah, but you could dance with other people. No. Oh. I know I must be acting needy, but I don't know what else to do. Can I, I sit alone with my fist. What? Can I dance with Ryuko? Isn't he your daddy? Yes. Then I don't know. Ask him. Ryuko, can I dance with you? Sit alone with my thoughts about dying at any moment. What is the matter, Marion? You know already, so I'll skip that question. As you wish. I heard you got kicked off from the orchestra. Seems you have heard lies. Oh? I resigned myself. I simply do not have the time for it now. But wasn't that your actual job? Yes, my life's work, to be, to be precise. And you just gave it up? That is correct. Well, obviously he liked it if he called it his life's work, so... Why does this feel oh. inconsequent? Like, this feels like it shouldn't be a choice. Okay. Welcome to the visual novels, baby. No, no, no. What I mean is, like, even in No Good Noel, every single dialogue choice is at a point. This feels like it shouldn't. You must be really busy. Yes. The king takes priority. Can you still sneak in some time to play every now and then? I am not a hobbyist, Marion. If I do something, I do it wholeheartedly. I do not dabble. Oh. <sighs> I apologize. That wasn't what I wanted to really say. What did you want to say? Had I stayed in the orchestra, I would have dragged everyone else down. I cannot practice that much anymore. I will fall behind. I can't force them to play with me. It's better for them to replace me with someone who has the time and dedication. I see. So that's how it is. It's sad, but I think that's wonderful. Huh? No, I don't think the blue-haired girl are from early- Okay, to explain, Sylvester, earlier in the game when he introduced himself, explained that, uh... Well, first, let me preface this. Marion said that most music boxes in this in this story, uh, or in this world, are usually female, and Sylvester is a rare, rare exception. And then Sylvester explained that it's because he's part of a set, and the set what? he was a part of uh, was with another girl, or with a girl that he used to dance with who gave up their kind of music that they do for beatboxing, beatboxing, which is why they no longer like dance together. But when he said set, he never explained whether or not that meant she was his sister or she was his partner. Just part of a set. Could be a sister. We don't know yet. I mean, yeah, it's sad you had to do that, but the fact that you're willing to do it, it's great. Like, uh, the music you played it meant more to you than you yourself. What is that? What? Mm. I can't put it into words at all. Sorry. Thank you, Marion. But it wasn't such a noble reason. I simply do not want to embarrass myself by playing badly next to my fellow musicians. Oh. <laughs> <sighs> I have been doing some thinking today. He says today, but it seems to me Sylvester does a lot of thinking every day. Is it unfair to keep everyone else in the dark about the situation? Yes. Perhaps they have dreams and goals they are aspiring to. Things they would like to do, if they knew the end is quite near. 
I think they should already know that. Because they could die any day, anyway. You say that, but, but are you not distressed over your death now, much more than you were before? He is, it seems. Well, I... yeah. In the end, I'm certain. Telling the other toys would be a terrible idea. Huh? Only panic and chaos would ensue. Toys would lose their sense of morals, knowing nothing will prevent their death anyway. Purge! Purge! To so doing all the horrible things they had never had the guts to do. Are we ever gonna They're remove fire from the jar, by the way? How dare you? <laughs> you don't have a lot of faith in the public, do you? <laughs> I believe there is good in all of us. But with good comes the bad. Right. Well, that's that, I guess. What, I, what else am I supposed to say? He thinks too much. Can I bounce one more thought off you? Sure, just don't expect any answers. I'm sure I don't want the toys to know about the king's condition. But I think they deserve to know the king is here, and that he is too ill to rule. Why? For peace of mind. I mean, that's true. Currently, hmm. They Currently, should at the very least know he's alive. Hmm. Currently, the missing king is a nagging mystery. They see Jack's presence as a cruel joke. Why is this clown here? Where is our beloved leader? If the toys would know the king is too sick to rule, I'm certain they would accept Jack. Mm. There is nothing wrong with how he rules after all. Just the way he carries himself. But I digress. Should the toys accept Jack as the, as the king, Jack would feel validated. With that confidence, perhaps Jack would agree to put his majesty to rest. It does sound reasonable. Plus, I don't see anything that says that Jack is bad at running the kingdom. Jack's just an asshole. Yeah, he's just an <laughs> asshole. Sounds reasonable enough. I don't know about Jack. I don't know Jack about Jack. I don't know Jack. But if you say he's like that, then I believe you. Based on my discussions with him, I'd say so. Well, I'd say his ego has inflated to overcompensate for his insecurity. If he would be accepted as the king, I believe he would no longer need the Sleeping King to fall back on. Right now, he tells me things like, Oh, it matters very little if I screw up anyway. I'm not the real king. But should I offhandedly compliment him on how well he has managed certain affairs, his eyes will light up. All I'm getting from this conversation is that Sylvester watches everyone like a hawk. Do you want Jack to be the king? I would much prefer that to the current situation, yes. Then, let's do it. We'll tell the toys the king is sick, and that's why Jack is the king now. Everyone can say their goodbyes, and the whole country moves on. Sounds simple when it's put so bluntly. Well, I don't think too much. Thank you, Marion. Huh? We will try your suggestion. It was your suggestion. I'll leave it oh, to you, you to tell son the of a bitch! The sickness. You son of a bitch! <laughs> you son of a bitch! But not his actual illness. Yeah, I got that. Perhaps a press conference would do. Why would they listen to a random servant? I'm not gonna run around <laughs> shouting at random toys. Because he's trustworthy. If you must. Yeah. I say goodnight to Sylvester and go to sleep. I feel a bit better now, now that we have a plan. You do not have a plan. That is some... A, it's kind of a plan. That's... That's a direction, at best. That's still a plan. And that has decided to, to stick somewhere. to her regular cooking for now. I like her experiments too, but they created a lot of extra work. Ah, <sighs> Something wrong? We're out of spices again. How? I just got huge jugs of them. Well, I was sorting the spices, Galiathos and... What? Galiathos tripped and landed on the table. It was like, poof! The most earthly colored cloud you'd ever seen. And the most costly. Ugh. He was so sorry about it, I couldn't even be mad. I'll go buy new ones. Thanks, but our budget for this month is almost gone. Ugh, that's my fault. I can't deny that, but I'm not gonna say anything. She looks guilty enough as is. I have to pay the spices from my own wallet, don't I? We still have salt. We still have salt. Right. I mean, if Jack wants something better, he can give us more money. Same thought. Oh yeah, that's right. 
Ah, thank you, Marion. What was I thinking? Let's make the most flavorless food today. <laughs> like we have any choice. We have salt, that's enough. We cook some bland lunch. It's Just over -salted. not that bad, to be honest. <laughs> See? Once the day is over, I head to town. More toy. Most toys are getting off work now, just like me. Tell everyone about the king. And maybe mention how great Jack is, too? Okay, I'll hold up on that one. I can't compliment Jack with a straight face just yet. He's just so mean. How dare you. Ah, uh, yes. Thank you for staying to just gamble in my chat, everybody. I appreciate you very much. Quick. Yeah, sure. I think you voice this character, too. I'll be back. I do voice this character. Good day. What is it? Have you heard the news? Is it true? Hmm? It what? Is what true? I tell him about the king as if I've just heard a rumor. Ooh, nice one, but that's not it. Uh, what? The king was actually abducted by aliens. And they're covering it up because they don't want us to know that aliens exist. What? Yeah? It's really crazy. Keep talking, girl. Everyone knows it's not true. Yeah? And your secret organization theory is so much better, huh? Hey, at least I have proof. I'm back. Your, oh. tax, in, your tax ID He's... matching the castle's address isn't proof. He's um, <laughs> excuse me? <laughs> yeah, this guy thinks the king just got the sniffles or something. He did get the sniffles. Should I voice him now or should you continue voicing him? You, please. <laughs> All right. <laughs> What's that? That makes no sense. N no, he is too sickly to rule, but he he's in the castle trying to recover. Ah, that's cute and all, but come on, sick for months. I He just tried really hard to get back up, but I guess it's not happening. Yeah, 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 yeah whatever, Blondie. I don't think I'll get anywhere with these toys. I'll try telling some others. Where's the where's the where's the blue hair girl? I walk around all evening, but in the end, no one listened. It seems everyone already has their own idea of what's happened. Like, did you know the king is a werewolf? But he's never turned back oh. into a toy, so now he's in hiding. The king never existed in the first place. He was just a collective dream. Na 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 da 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 da. da. I was taken for another lunatic with too much time Wait. on my hands. Why the AOT theme? <laughs> collective <laughs> illusion. You know, Aww. I'm sorry. Quick spoiler. Everyone in AOT had their memories wiped. Oh. Once the night comes, I go to Sylvester. I tell him what happened. Uh. The toys sure are creative. Wait, sorry. Let me just... Have we encountered any sussy dialogue or taboo things? We were pretty much discussing genocide and suicide earlier. Don't worry about you. <laughs> My story didn't stand a chance. Ours is not a story, Marion. Oh, yeah. I know, but... You know... <sighs> With all these theories floating about, you will never be heard. And we can't very well take everyone on a tour to see the king themselves. If only there were some method to pique everyone's interest. Rumors... Like a picture. Honestly, rumors is probably the way to do it. Hmm? Wouldn't we already try spreading rumors? Yeah, but we... <sighs> like bad news? Well, yes. Bad news spreads faster than good news. I'm surprised you paid attention to such things. It's not that I paid attention. That's just how it is. Yes, I suppose. Alright, good night, Nekomi. Good night, Nekomi. <laughs> Maybe the toys would listen if we scare them a bit with our information. I believe they would make hasty decisions out of fear. I kind of feel doubtful anyone would do anything, to be honest. Hmm? I mean, the king has been missing for months now, and everyone is still minding their own business. As they should. But telling, th but telling them their lives are in serious danger will make the king's condition their business. Right. Let's think about it some more. We really don't have the time. Yes, you're right. But we can't act without a plan either. Saddam has, hydra has redeemed a hydrate. I'm gonna go water one of the saplings in your honor, Saddam. Thank you very much. Thanks for the hydrate, Saddam. Oh, hydrate? Oh no! Oh no! The jar is filling up further! <laughs> Tasty. Mm -hmm. 
Ah, right. Shin, you bastard! Shin has hydrated again. Oh, no. Oh, no. Once again, the jar seems to have grown more, <sighs> more, more, more liquid. Okay. Yeah, yeah, let's, hey. let's just tell everyone about the king. Did you hear a word of what I said? I did. You're being a wimp. You bitch. Pardon? Sure, the people will be scared. And they should be scared. This is terrifying. But we can't just keep thinking about it forever. The king could awaken at any moment. We need to act. I don't disagree with you, but... But, but what? Hmm. I won't tell anyone if you seriously don't want me to, but don't expect me to stick around. I'll spend the rest of my life somewhere far, far from here. Maybe another country's king will see the disaster and just invade Toyboxian. Hopefully killing the king while at it. You would just run away? you just sit here and die? There could be another solution if we just... Just think about it! Right, right, I got that part already. And I think I'm going home. Marion, please. Wait. Please, wait. No, I'm sick of thinking and talking and waiting while nothing happens. I understand. <sighs> we will do it your way. Huh? Really? Yes. You are right. That's... That was easier than I thought. I will say, I don't agree with you at all. And I think this is such an awful way to deal with this. But we do not have the time anymore. I saw the king just today. It just it, occurred it to was... me that we probably should have been saving. It's fine, the skip options. Let's just let's just say that Jack is really struggling to keep his majesty asleep. Uh whatever the public decides to do is better than waiting for the king to destroy the kingdom. Why do you have no timer for Hydra? Because I don't drink water. Yes, exactly. Thank you, Sylph. You are calling me that too now? Yeah. It feels like a drop in status. Do you respect me less? Oh, come on, it's a pet name. Those are degrading. No, those are sin friendship. <sighs> Very well. Tomorrow, then. Let us tell everyone about their inevitable death and witness the disaster. I hope you guys try to get the BL endings at least. I'm pretty sure all of these are BL considering Marion is a dude. Yeah. Unless there's an Annette route. <laughs> That's true. All right, good night, Sylph. Good night, Mary. What? Why Mary? It's a cute, friendly pet name. Do you like it, <gasps> Maria? Thanks to them. I appreciate you Wait, so Maria. much. Who is this Maria? Lady Maria? Why the doll? <laughs> you named the doll Maria? The blonde doll Lady Maria? I was going for Shadow the Hedgehog, but you know that works. <laughs> you and I have completely different directions of brain. Who is this Maria? And why does her name haunt me? Who, Maria! Who Chaos is this Maria? Control! <laughs> ha! Good hunter. Welcome home. Fine, no pet names. Thank you, Marion. But how come Bunny can call you Sylph, but I can't? Once your IQ drops below 12 too, you can call me whatever you wish. Man, poor Bunny. I'm glad he didn't have to hear that. It's not <laughs> very nice. I did not mean it. I'm simply agitated right now. So I'm basically, I... Lemafau, I think you're spoiling a little bit that we've gotten an ending that's not very romantic. It's fine, I guess. It's late anyway. Let's forget this and continue our mission tomorrow. Yes, together. All right. Good night, Sylvester. I really am thankful you're giving my plan a go. Yes. Good night, Marion. Well, it looks like I got on Sylv's bad side. What? But it doesn't matter. What matters is the plan. Finally, finally we can act. I just want this ordeal to be over with. I fall asleep thinking about the most efficient way to spread the bad news. Today, I have to make sure everyone's terrified. We'll all die if the king isn't killed. I'm sure Jack will come around too once he sees every one of his subjects is against his decision. Even he has to cave into that kind of pressure. How should I spread the bad news? Tell the news, man. You can see her. We this already tried the, the first one. 
I'll start with the news magazine. They'll be thrilled for such a headline. A pinwheel? What? what is that crap? I'm sick of hearing your doomsday garbage. Give me something original for once. You write about celebrity gossip and bird nesting. I'm giving you the story of the century. Oh yeah, everyone dies. The game is evil, yada yada. Don't you think I've heard that a million times in the last couple months? The king has been ridden to death, and there is nothing you can offer that would give it a fresh spin. But this is serious. I just told you if the king wakes up, we are all going to die. We're gonna Dead. be... Okay. <laughs> Dead. Just like my interest in your scoop. Oh, uh, listen! I'm telling you, your story sucks. Deal with it. Come back when you have something new. I can't believe this. What now? I guess I could still just scream about it. Ah, oh, shit, wait, uh... <laughs> hey, I remember you. Um... Change your mind, huh? About joining my cause? Uh, what? Dude, marching to the castle. Our revolution, don't you remember? Uh, kinda. I got all kinds of toys behind me now. I bet you feel pretty stupid turning me down earlier. Wait. This gal's been collecting toys who are all ready to barge into the castle? Doesn't look like she's going anywhere with it, though. She's just out here recruiting. Tell you what, I know a pretty influential guy who would be pretty interested. Oh, yeah? Come by the castle tonight. Is this a trap? Oh, well, if you're not interested. All right, all right. Maybe I'll show up. Maybe. She'll show up. She's impulsive enough to start a mob. No way she can contain her curiosity. Oh shit, we're gonna- oh no. Oh boy. I tell Sylvester about the lady and our plans to meet tonight. Mm. Hmm. What? That is, frankly, your most idiotic idea so far. What do you mean by that? Teaming up with some rogue woman and her ill-tempered mob. Do you wish to kill everyone in this castle? There was no talking about killing anyone. Yet. <sighs> I despise senseless violence. It doesn't have to be senseless. They just want whatever it is, and we want the king dead. We do? This is news to me. Oh, yes. Yes, we do. <sighs> whatever happened to doing things my way? I did say that. Very well. Let us meet this woman. Yeah, thanks, Sylv. Mm. Bester! Sylvester! Ha 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 ha. We wait until midnight. Hmm. Oh, listen to the music. This is so Andy and Lele sounding. Kinda, yeah. Right? Oh, man. I mean, you, I, I guess... To be fair, I guess you can see, if this is their first game, you can see how that progressed into like No Good Noel and and Coffin of Andy and Lele, you know? You can hear it, you can see it in the visuals, the art style evolution, yeah, it. it's nuts. Mm. This like, mm. how old, okay, quick question to most of you who probably know this better than us. How old is this game slash what are the, like the intervals of time between the game releases? Because I'm actually this is curious. 2019. This is 2019, and in yes. when in 2023 was when Andy and Lily was released. Yes. Four years and that much improvement. Holy, good for them, I guess. Okay, Marion. Hmm. She's not here. Of course not. No lady with a shred of common sense oh, would no. meet up alone with a stranger at midnight. Yeah, but. Ah, I take that back. I can hear a lot of others are nearby. I can't hear anyone. Or see anyone. Please come out and introduce yourselves. Hey, yeah. Long time no see. She was hiding in the bushes! <sighs> Forget it. Let's head back. Huh? But... Huh? Yeah, I figured you ain't gonna help us now. With you being so busy sucking the temporary king's... Sylvia, please. I have asked you a million times to watch your language. You two know each other. Oh, 
There you go. Oh, there you go. This is sister. Dang it, Nekomi. Dang it, Nekomi. You had to you had to go and leave when the sister was actually revealed to be a sister. God dang it. So it's confirmed it's a sister. Yippee! Of course there's a sister. Why wouldn't there be a sister? Oh yeah, that stuck up boy the music box is my brother. <clears throat> I believe I've mentioned her once. She is the other half of my set. Other half? Sorry. Oh. Marion, this is Sylvia, my twin sister. Oh, nice to meet you. Ditto. But you said you knew someone who'd want to help us with our cause. I know he ain't gonna do that. Sylvester's too worried about his standing and his honor and his status and his everything to do anything. Simply because I refuse to make a complete joke of you fucking... <laughs> you, you went down to... <laughs> complete joke of myself like you. Doesn't mean I only care about myself. Tell me, sister. <laughs> How did your beatboxing career turn out? Judging by the fact that you are here now, leading a revolution, I'd say it has gone south. Oh. Oh, yeah? Well, I heard you got kicked out of the orchestra. So good job staying all prim and proper. That went real well, huh? I was not kicked out. I simply... I really don't want to get wrapped up in the sound family affairs right now. So, hey, we're all about to die. So, uh... Die. <sighs> you are right, Marion. As terrible as my sister's taste in music is, they have a bigger problem at hand. What are you talking about? We explained the situation to Sylvia, and her crew still hiding in the bushes. She's shocked, of course, but I think she took it a lot better than I did. Man. Dude. This is you. Oh. Hey guys, this sucks, huh? As you can see, she is incredi uh, incredibly proficient at expressing herself. Music to your ears, is it not? If I didn't know any better, I'd say Sylvester's picking a fight on purpose. Whatever, we gotta strike the castle ASAP and kill the king! Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I mean, yes, I think so, too. Let's go! Stop. What? Why? Yeah, what is it now, you walking wet blanket? As small as this castle staff is right now, the, ca the guards are still heavily armed. Ain't they sleeping right now? Let's go! You rush in head first if you wish. Meanwhile, I will devise a plan of attack. Oh... Are we, we helping home, girl, or are we helping home, boy? Look, look, here's the thing. Home girl comes with a mob. Home boy, smart. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> well, there we go. We should at least have some sort of plan. I mean, at least I'd warn the cook so she can leave. Her cooking's really good when she's not trying too hard, that is. Exactly. We don't want to- we don't want any bystanders getting hurt. We only want to eliminate the king. Fine... But that plan better be ready by tomorrow, because we're going in by then. I will do my best to have a plan by tomorrow evening. We will meet here with everyone who is willing to join our raid. But I must insist, anyone who wants in just so they can loot the castle and cause havoc can stay home. Lama Fao said she's got Ashley vibes. I wonder if she's got Ashley vibes because she's got Ashley vibes or she's got Ashley vibes because I'm using Ashley's voice for her. It's because she's a sister. What is it with my chat and sisters? <laughs> All right. Hey, readables in chat, maybe that's why. We don't talk about that. Right, right, of course. So, tomorrow then, don't check it out. She and her bush-looking friends leave. Or quite a few more than I expected, it's like a clown car. <sighs> this is such a bad idea. It has to be done. Yes. 
After tomorrow, I can finally rest easy. This will work out. There is no way such a small amount of guards can keep Sylvia's mob out. Me or Sylvester can read them. The, the Sylvester, my my Asian jumped out. Sir Sylvester, my Asian jumped out. Sorry, sorry. Me or Sylvester can lead them right to the king's door. We might even get that far without any guards at all for quiet. Who am I kidding? It's going to be a disaster. Maybe I can sneak out during all the ruckus and avoid getting slashed with a sword. Nope, nope. Calm down. I have to do this. Or there won't be any more tomorrows to come. Rest easy. One more night, stupid king. Tomorrow you die. I feel like we're not getting a good ending here. Don't worry about Morning, Sylvester. What is it, Marin? I'm incredibly busy. Sorry, I just wanted to ask something. Yes? Are we still getting executed after this for killing the king? I do not believe so. Huh? Sylvia's mob will most likely take care of that. What do you mean? I mean, what will happen is what always happens with mob justice. Yeah, I don't like mob justice, which is why I wish this wasn't the route we're going to go down. The situation will grow out of control. Boys will die left and right. Okay. Someone will, someone will decide... Hey, isn't this all Jack's fault too? And that's that. Oh. I wish I was smarter. I wish I'd prevented this. I oh. wish I hadn't told you anything. I should have killed the king myself in secret and suffered the consequences of that alone. Dude, don't say that. It makes me sad just thinking about it. We're in this together now. Deal with it. Yes, I'm just ruminating. However, I really am busy trying to come up with a plan that would minimize the damage. Got it. I'll see you tonight. Just one thing, since you are here. He throws me keys. We're gonna free Bunny? Hey! Hey! Did you get Bunny out of the dungeon? Since when did you have these? For a while, but Bunny does not need to know that. Yeah, he'd be pretty pissed. I will see you later. Right. I show up Don't in the kitchen. Don't worry about it, Shin. Yeah, don't worry about it's it. It's like shit. me with Priscilla. <laughs> don't worry about it. Oh boy, you're late. Did you forget to set the alarm? Sorry, there's something. How should I do this? Do we sugarcoat it? Fuck no! You have to go home. What? W why? I heard rumors about some group of toys planning to raid the castle. Oh, that's awful. We have to tell Jack. No. Huh? I mean, I already did. He told me to tell you and the other servants so you can go home. The guards will take care of it. Oh, okay, but but still, this is awful. Why would they do such a thing? <laughs> I don't know, but you need to go right now. I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, oh, okay. Stay safe. Yes, you be careful too. There she goes. Yippee! I hope she won't stay in chat with the guards or anything. Thanks for the sparks, Max! Of course you show back up with sparks. Thanks, Max. Alright, next. Galeathos is cutting down Galeathos. lines. He has no idea those come from the king, though. You look busy. Uh, hello, Marion. Uh, oh, oh, you thought sorry. we got it right! I think I got your name wrong. Sorry. No, that's actually... No, 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 no. <laughs> Don't say it. Uh, I remember it. It's Mike. Yeah, sure. I'm Mike. Mike Magic. Phew. Almost made a fool of myself. <laughs> Are you working tonight? Are you hitting on me? Of course. Why? Don't you think you uh, deserve a night off? When's the last time you had a holiday? I... well, I... I've got an important job. When I slack off, it, it's always bad. When How I... do I convince him to go home tonight? Reasoning or emotion? Are I you tired? Emotion. You should take some time off. Uh, uh, I'm not that tired. You are. I can see it in your posture. He quickly stands up straighter. I was only hunched over to cut out, uh, to cut that branch. You didn't lose anything, Max. I'm just worried you keep giving sparks and things. It's fine. We all need breaks sometimes, man. I'm fine. Thank you. I mean, come on. You should take it easy tonight. No. I I'm okay. L please, leave me alone. Okay, sorry. Shit. 
It's not like I was trying to challenge your sturdiness or anything like that. I'm not bothered. Ah, uh, shit. I am not tired. All Bye -bye. right. I don't think I can turn his head anymore, but he's just... <sighs> he's Jack's trustiest guard, right? He'll be okay. I think. Bye -bye. Oh, no. One last thing to take care of. Oh, oh, did you bring me food? No, but I bought you freedom. I take out the keys that Sylvester gave me. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, thank you. This is actually very cute. I would hug you, but... I've been stuck here too long. I want a bath. No, I want food. I want to eat food while I bathe. Oh, all right. Okay, I'll let you out safely, but you need to stay quiet. Gotcha. Quiet as a mouse. Zip. Oh, oh, can we go by the, the kitchen? That is one loud mouse. No, but can we? Shh, I told you, no. Please. No, stop. But I'm starving and dirty. Bunny. They took my wallet and everything. Shut up. I don't even have the keys to my house. Please stop. Uh, the food in there is probably all moldy now anyway. Yikes. For the love of- I don't have time for this. And I don't have time to explain to Bunny why I don't have time for this. Just shut your trap, you stupid airhead. That's not very nice at all. I'm giving you some money, so be quiet and get out. Oh, okay. But give me more money first. You're just hurt. You hurt my feelings a lot just now. I throw my wallet in Buddy's face and he happily hops away. I will oh. never see that wallet again. It's nearing the time we meet up with Sylvia. Just another hour or two. Maybe I'll go check in on Jack. Just so I know where he is. I don't feel good about this. I make my way up to the tower and notice the door is slightly open. I can hear a conversation. This evening is... This evening a great concert is being played. I don't have the time right now. And you're not playing anyway, so who cares? I'm flattered, but I am quite impressed with the lineup. I insist we go listen. Are you asking me out on a date? A business lunch, if you will. Look, it's fine if you want to sit. Fine if you want to see it. You can go. No, I suppose it's not that important. Okay, whatever. So, about the spell, I notice it's a bit dimmer again. I had to cast it three times today. I'm going to have to hire a full-time spellcaster if this keeps up. And I suppose a night shift one, too. Hmm. Did you hear me? Yes, I... What was that? Oh, shit. I look out the window. It's Sylvia's mom. But this isn't the time we agreed on. They haven't even heard Sylvester's plan yet. Neither have I! Huh? What are you doing here? Oh, I was just, um, <sighs> uh, Sylvester is oddly calm. Isn't he mad? Sylvia's acting on her own. He probably knew this was gonna happen. It doesn't matter, we're being attacked! Yes, I noticed. Thank you. We need to escape. Follow me. We follow Sylvester and keep hearing toys yelling and things breaking, but also laughter. It gives me an eerie feeling, like this isn't really happening, but Sylvester is calm. And Jack looks more angry than scared. Who are these animals? I'll have them all killed! Yes, we will be summoning reinforcements as soon as we are out. That's probably enough time for the mob to reach the king. Jack looks outside. Huh. Don't think about it now, Jack. Don't think about it! That's where his majesty is! You are his majesty. Our top priority is you. Never mind. I don't think Sylvester's that calm. How did they find their way in? We have to get there right now. No, we do not. Wow. Okay. I had no idea his voice could get so loud. He wasn't even yelling. Excuse me? The king's door is locked tight. We are leaving it. You know now. what? You know what? We're doing this. D you say this in a you say this in a calm tone, and I'm gonna boost your I'm gonna boost your audio to the loudest. Do it. Uh, sure. Tell me where to go. Do it. No, we do not. Oh shit! That's perfect, actually. 
I'm gonna cut that in later. Cool. Wow, okay, I had no idea his voice could get so loud. He wasn't even yelling. Excuse me? The king's door is locked tight. We are leaving now. Quit joking around. We're not even, we are not letting those beasts harm his majesty. What could you possibly do to stop them? Uh. Only one king needs perish tonight, and it isn't you. You knew they were coming. We have to go. Jack! Do we go after him? <sighs> no. Oh, I have a feeling this is the I bad ending. I will not ending. have us in the middle of that mess. <sighs> <sighs> we must go. Amidst all the noise, screaming and crying and laughter, Sylvester and I make our way outside in silence. We made it. Yes. I had told them not to enter through this route. Uh, so then... Yes. I gave them the order to strike now. I... I could have still been in there. They would not have attacked you. You're on their side. Uh, yeah, but still. I'm sorry. It was the best time, according to my calculations. No, it's fine. I mean, you're right, anyway. Like you always are. Like he said, we shouldn't tell anyone about the king. I think it was a mistake. I think it was a necessary mistake still. The king will no longer be a threat. Hmm. Some of the servants and guards are still surely inside the castle. Eliathos, too. What, <clears throat> what do we do now? Sylvia will be here soon. She will confirm the king's death herself. And dead he is! Call me Sylvia, the bane of kings. Please do not sound so triumphant. It is the most distasteful. <laughs> but I killed two kings just now. Isn't that something? Oh. <sighs> hey, I had to, all right. You told me I had to. Yes, I did. So buckle up. This marks a new era for Toy Boxian. A time without mon- I'm actually pretty okay with that. A time without monarchy. Don't be foolish. Now, if ever, Toy Boxian needs a leader. A leader, yeah, so just not a monarchy. Everything is in chaos. Well, well yeah, I mean, but there isn't anyone, you know? That's why Jack was the temporary king. There ain't no royalty in Tyboxian anymore. I should be king! <laughs> you wanna? Me! You want to? You wanna choose it? I feel like this is a bad ending anyway. Save it, and then choose it. Oh, wait. Now no. skip, you don't... <laughs> I am not human. I should be the king. Uh, <laughs> no? <laughs> <laughs> no way! Never! Not a chance! For once, I'm in full agreement with you. <laughs> right? It was a suggestion. You need to be way more full of yourself and arrogant. Like Sylvester. <sighs> Maybe he should be the king. I do not believe so. Yeah, you should, because you're a bore, and you sit around letting a lady like me do your dirty work. I do not have to listen to this. Show us who's boss, your majesty. Please, stop. Then it's decided. King Sylvester. Long live the king. <sighs> Is that it? Sylvester does not seem happy at all, but he agreed to become the king anyway. After all, he was the right-hand man of the temporary king. He was respected by Sylvia's crew, though not by Sylvia herself. And the toys were already familiar with Sylvester through his music. Such an Seeing such an elegant music box take charge after Jack was actually very welcomed. Today, we're picking up important documents and whatnot in Jack's room. I can't believe you guys. Everything happened without me. That's what you get for being caught. I should have been there instead of Sylvia. Actually, same thought. You had just gotten out of prison. Mm, yeah, but... 
But I'm way cuter than her. Yes, you are. What kind of backwards logic? Do you really wish to have been in the midst of the midst of bloodshed, killing his majesty as well as Jack? Well, no, but... But... Well... But... Well, maybe, Jack, but... Come on, you don't have to keep bringing that up. Yeah, you're the king now. Be a little happier. Yeah, be an inspiration to us all. I've inspired nothing but terrible things. Blech, still was all moody again. I'm gonna go grab us some cakes. They've made it in the shape of a... The note thing. The what? Mm, you know, the really music icon in all songbook covers. The G-Clef. Right, whatever he just said. <sighs> you alright, your majesty? Please, do, uh, don't call me that. Why not? We're fine now. Everything's fine. It is not fine at all. What do you mean? How can you smile like that? He killed the king and Jack. Many other toys lost their lives for this, too. Well, yeah, but we had to. For the greater good. For Toy Boxian. This is not fair at all. I kind of agree with him. We have taken lives. Therefore, we, too, should lose our lives. Hey, yo? Wow, okay, come on, Sylvester. The fact that you feel so bad about it only proves you'll be a good king. And I'm gonna support you with all my dull heart. Hmm. Besides, I know you're kind and wise. You know, you really are. <sighs> Thank you. You make the sacrifices worth it. I know it. If you say so, Marian. Marian. Huh? What is, why did I say say that with Jap with Japanese style? What? Marion. If you say so, Marion. Marion. So does it, Marion. <laughs> I do. We'll be just fine, bruh. Sylvester just needs some time. I'm sure he's beating himself up because he couldn't find a peaceful solution. But I don't think there was that kind of solution to be found. This what is how. There? Nah, this probably. This is how the world is, isn't it? Yes. How unsightly. Oh, he. Oh, no. Uh. That aww. doesn't look happy. He is right. not happy. He is very sad. All right. So we're going to try to get the good... Unfortunately, apparently, there's so many routes on this that we're not going to try to get them all tonight. In fact, I don't mm. think we're going to try and get them at all. all at all. <laughs> mm. It's going to be pretty hard. So we're going to try at least to get Sylvester's good ending tonight. So let's skip... You want me to look up a guide? No, it's fine. I think I, yeah? I think I know everything we need to do. I remember which ones pretty much fucked this up. Okay. Actually, let's... I think we skip this as well. No, I want to yeah. see this one. Hey! Ah! Except maybe that guy. Uh, excuse me, sir. Uh, may I be of assistance? I can't find my way to the castle. The king isn't having a speech today. Or tomorrow. Or anytime soon. Or ever, it seems. I'm not here for a speech. I'm starting as a servant there. My apologies. The castle is that building over there. Bitch. Is he messing with me? What am I even looking at? Uh, it's been that way ever since the king withdrew himself uh, withdrew himself in it. Good luck with your work. Thank you. Okay, uh, skips. We said I don't kitchen. know last time. We said I don't know last time, yeah, so kitchen. I enter the room. Cooks are preparing a meal and it smells delicious. And still, there are less toys than I expected. In fact, the whole castle feels empty in general. Good day. Oh, good day. You must be the new servant. Uh, yeah, I'm Marion. Annette, you can call me Anne. Have you spoken with Jack yet? His room is up in the tower. I'll go see him. Thank you. The stairs never seem to end. It's really uncomfortable. In a okay, let's skip it. Uh... I don't think it matters, because this is more Jack than anything else, right? Mm hmm. Okay. Skippy. Uh, kitchen, clean the toilets. Nowhere! We said nowhere last time. We'll do the kitchen yes. again. Sure, yeah. Hello there. Here's some breakfast for you. Thank you. Is there anything I could help with? No, 
no, I've got all I need. Everything is in tight order, so I won't have the time to look after you out of the blue like this. But thank you, dear. I'll ask if I need you later. She seems uh, happy I offered my help regardless. I finish my food and decide to walk around for a bit. I think I hear something. Ah, there they are. I think this is a uh, press skip, I think. Yeah. Uh, uh, which one? We are simply gathering intel. Yep. You really shouldn't be here. I have to call the guards if you don't leave. Guards, my Okay, we already seen this. I am. Okay, Sylvester. I think we chose Sylvester, yep. Let's, Let's go, Mr. Silv. Let's go, Sylv. Um, I'm sorry you don't have to tell me. Uh, you don't have to tell me, probably. Sure. Are you okay. friends? Uh, I guess... Ah, uh, okay, that works, yep. Uh... Okay. I think we have to follow them? We considering... did follow them last time. We did follow them last time? But let's, let's see. The thing. Maybe some of like our choices are... Yeah. Uh, hmm. Let's stay away from them. I don't think that's an option. If anything, we should try to find the source. Do you think these things are related to the missing king? It's hard to say. Hard to say. Oh, no, yeah, this is new. Hey, maybe the king ran away because of the vines. Hmm. That was a joke. I don't understand which part was supposed to be funny. Uh-huh. Uh, anyway, let's keep going. Seems the vine... I think okay, we already yeah, read this, yeah? This one. Uh, try again. Okay, mm-hmm. Then skip. Meet Bunny and Sylvester, I, th mm, I think so. Mm. I don't know. We. This is what we did last time, and it didn't work yeah, out. It didn't work out? Fair enough. Okay. There's never enough workers in the kitchen, right? I'll ask someone there. The cook is looking busy. What was her name again? Annette? She looks like she's in charge here. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, I reversed that. Do you start working today? Uh, yeah. Is there anything you need me for? Oh, yes. Absolutely. I was hoping she'd say no. Have you seen those swirly, vinish things around the castle? How could I not? Right, they're everywhere. I kept them out of the kitchen, but there's so many. If you could just go around giving them a snip here and there, that'd be great. Uh, sure. I'll get right to it. Lucky, I get to go meet Sylvester and Bunny after all. Okay, so it didn't matter. I'll just hmm. cut vines uh, as I go along. Hey, guys. You're late. Sorry. Good to see you. And I think we already went through this. Yep. We're going with Sylvester. We Okay. Uh, follow, follow the, the vines. vines. Right? Yeah. Yep. Let's just follow the vines. Okay, we've seen it. Last Let's time I said... I, last time I said tear it on fire. Yeah, so this time we kick it open. Let's kick it open. Be my guest, Marion. Uh, me? Yes, I don't think I'm strong enough to do that. Me neither. What a shame. We must find another way, then. Yeah, it's probably gonna be hard, Lama Fab, but we're gonna get damn well try anyway. Right. Thanks for the hydrate, Nuggies. Oh, yeah, Nuggies gave it a hydrate. Go ahead. I'll water a, I'll water a, a chicken nugget plant for you, Nuggies. Mm. All right. Even though I try, I just don't have any ideas. Soon my mind stops trying and starts wandering about. I wonder how Bunny's doing. Oh, uh, this is the one where Bunny got arrested. Yep. When, where, uh... I'm guessing. What I'm getting is he doesn't seem to like it when we ask him too many questions. Or at least mm. when we act on our own. So we have to trust him. Okay. Uh, uh, we could ask. Yeah, yeah. He appreciated us asking last time. I don't know if this matters mm. because we are not taking his route, but like we'll see. Mm. Galileo. Hello, Galileo. Galileo. He must okay. really like Mr. Sound. Like him or not, a right-hand man is the second highest position here in the castle. Or third highest, since this is the guy that is the right hand for the king's right hand. Honestly, what is Jack thinking? He's not the king! How dare he act like it! And we've heard this. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. Uh, Do we say goodnight or do we say wait? I think we said wait. I'm not sure I should wander around so much. Someone's going to... Okay, yeah, yeah, this is us being cautious. He'd like that, I think. Mm. Sylvester is such a good is, man. He is. He sure is. You think so too? I we we picked this last time. 
okay, he doesn't like if we outright question him. So Jack sure likes you. Uh, I guess don't pry into it? Yeah, we have to trust him. Because he said, in the end, he said that telling us was a mistake, so maybe we have to wait. Mm. Still, he said he needed to ask Jack some things. He'll tell me about it later. I'll just wait until then. We say our goodnights, and I leave. I couldn't sleep. I kept wondering about the king. If he's alive, why isn't he here? Is he in that room? What was Sylvester being so secretive about? We're supposed to be in this together. Okay. Uh... uh Bunny's Did sleeping. we wake up, Bunny? Yeah, we, we, we're trying to... We wake him up to feed him anyway. You're trying too hard. You're trying too hard. I am, but I really want him to like my cooking. I think your regular cooking is great. We've seen this. Yep. Trusted. Yep. He told me to wait, but I didn't. But last time we said I just wanted to learn, and he yep. didn't like that. If Jack wanted to mm. be the one to open the door, I would have been screwed. I should be more patient, more careful. I decide not to visit Sylvester tonight. He's probably pissed at me. Uh, come in. Uh, I think they already read this. Good evening, Marion. Yep. See? Uh, what did we say? We said I should just wait last time, and I'm guessing he didn't yeah. like that, so I understand. Yeah, we have to understand. I get it. I'm sorry. This isn't how I imagined it. I just want to find the king. <sighs> I understand. Uh, I'm sorry. Okay. I think we, yeah, I think we already read it. Yes. Okay. Uh, that's stupid. That's stupid, Risco. That's stupid. Stupid? Are you stupid? Calling us stupid? Yeah, an angry mob is a brilliant idea. Best case scenario, you only get a few toys killed. Wonderful. I see you don't care about the king or our country. Some man you are, huh? Is that all you dolls are good for, after all? Being quiet, looking pretty. I just think your plan should be flushed down the toilet like the piece of crap that it is. Whoa there, princess. Let's hear your ingenious plan of action, then. I don't have to tell you anything. Have a nice day! Yeah, I figured as much. But hey, when you change your mind, you'll find me right here. Da da da. She's just as pretentious. You wish I hadn't told you. Uh... Hmm. Save here, just in case. Yeah, I don't know about this one. So the last time... We said, last I wanted said to I know. Wanted. But does yes. that matter? Because at this point, he did tell us. Uh, I think I wanted to know makes more sense. Okay, I wanted to know. I don't care that it's scary. I wanted to know what's going on. The king is dangerous? Who cares what Jack I wants? Think, I think but the king is dangerous. Oh. King is dangerous, yeah. Because I feel like he care he actually cares about Jack. Yeah. Hugs. Huggies. Slacking off, huh? Yeah, yeah. Slacking off, huh? Hold on. <laughs> That's perfect. No, no, no. I'm, I'm on a coffee break. I, I swear. <laughs> I know, I know. Any good news? L Lady okay. hairdresser. Uh, yeah. Same shit. Uh, didn't you like it? You must be really busy. This might be the right one. Like, he yeah. know, uh, him knowing we care about his well-being. Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Sounds reasonable. Jack? Yeah, sounds reasonable enough. Uh, reasonable enough? Okay. We have to trust him. I don't know. Jack about Jack. Uh, we have salt. Let's split the cost. Let's see if this makes any difference. Maybe they'll like the food better. Let's okay. split the cost. Would you really do that for me? Yeah, it's okay. We'll take our money back from the next budget. Yeah, let's think of it like a loan. All right, good. Thank you, Marion. Don't mention it. I'll be eating this food too, you know. Still, you're so kind. What kind of treats do you like? I'll make you some later. We sort out the spice issue and make some decent lunch. Once the day is over, I head to town. Most toys are getting off work just like me. I have to tell everyone about the king. Okay, this we've done. Okay. I guess, like, rumors. E we said bad news last time, right? Yes. Okay, rumors. Like, rumors? 
Yes, rumors spread fast, but I think rumors about the king have become too commonplace to be affected. That was our worry too, so I wonder if that'll matter. Uh... You just witnessed that firsthand. Uh, yeah, that's true. I'm thinking more of the, along the lines of bad news. Should we scroll back and try it again? Sure, yeah. Bad news then. Then we'll skip. skip up. Wait! Oh, this is new! This is new! That's new! Yes. Galeathos. But the amount- he's always working hard, but the amount of violence has seemed to lessen. I don't understand. What is it? These plants. I trimmed them just- uh, I just trimmed them yesterday. But alas, they're a hydra. I find this position- this, like, pose so fucking cute. <laughs> he's <laughs> just like, no! Oh. Cut one down, two emerge. How fearsome. Yes, a nightmare. You're you, a hero. You can do it. <sighs> yes. It is not a matter of a matter of if I can. I must. I like this guy. You know what? I might play this on my own just to see if I can get his ending. <laughs> <laughs> These halls are used every day. These the vines can't, or they shouldn't. I mean, they're in the way. Yeah. Let me let me skip scene. Okay. Just making sure. Well, I must continue. Have a good day, Mjorn. <laughs> Where does he get these names, man? I should get to work too. Whoa! What was that? An earthquake? No, it was this. Oh, this is this new. This has happened before. This is new. I didn't know the capital has earthquakes. No, not an earthquake. The shakes happened before the castle got warped. It were, was around the time these vines started appearing, too. Okay, we've definitely gotten a new route or ending, but I don't know whether or not it's good. Don't tell me. <laughs> the quake summoned vines! Huh? It, it must be. The vines grow from, from the within the earth. And the shakes release them. Correlation does not equal causation. This is a fallacy. Yeah. Why do you? Galia Galiathos is on or something. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we must. We must have angered the earth, and now the castle is cursed. What are you talking about, dude? Don't you see, Michael? Mike. This is what we deserve for not recycling better. <laughs> you know what? I agree with you. Take better care of Mother Earth. Of the Earth. I must tell Jack. And the guard runs off. I know the vines come from the king, but I don't know about the quake. Still, I highly doubt it's because of insufficient recycling. The cook seems the same as ever. She isn't bothered by the quake, or she just didn't feel it. I decide not to ask her. I doubt she would know anyway. After my shift, I go looking for Sylvester. He's likely in with Jack in the tower. The door is just slightly open. I can hear both Jack and Sylvester. What are you talking about? That's the worst idea so far. Now, now, Jack. You didn't let me finish. No way I'm telling some backwater town pseudo-wise man about the king. He's gonna lose his mind! Jack? This is clearly not something we can, we can solve by ourselves. <laughs> let him cook. We should gather all the wise men in the land and discuss the matter over. What is there to discuss, Sylvester? The answer is obvious! Then perhaps we should we should do just that. We are not killing his majesty off! Jack. We are not! We cannot! We will not! It Damn. might be that there is a solution we cannot that we can't think of. That is precisely why I want to hear out the intellectuals. It is through a discussion that. A mutual decision to murder his majesty is reached. <sighs> I don't want to. I don't. I will leave you to think it over. The fuck, he's coming! And he died! But there's nowhere to hide in the tower! I decide to run down the stairs instead. I don't think he saw me. Hello, Marion. Ah, shit, he saw me. I know he saw me. I follow him to his room. I thought I asked you not to do that anymore. It was an accident! I was looking for you. Did it not occur to you to knock? <laughs> I assume you overheard my discussion with Jack? Yeah. 
I feel as though I'm dealing with a terrified child. I'm not terrified. I'm talking about Jack, you idiot. <laughs> okay. Not listen. Oh, we're about to get. We're about to get. Are we about to get? Uh, we're about to put Chakra? some animosity in our in our in our voice acting. Sure, bro. Fuck you. I don't know if I can keep my calm for much longer. Then don't keep it. I think we sh he should here. keep calm. I feel like he Is should be keeping calm. Right? Yeah. You seem calm to me. Thank you. I'm trying my best. It is only through discussion that this matter can move forward. Yeah, since Jack's the king right now. But still, it's just so frustrating. Well, what do we do, smartass? I will invite your master over over regardless, bitch. Huh? The fuck do you know about him? I know many of things about him. I was his escort once. <laughs> bitch. <laughs> if Jack wants to act like a child in front of him, let him. But if he has any common sense, he'll reel in his behavior. Won't he just lash out at you later? That may be, unless Jack decides your master is indeed trustworthy. Then I should invite him, huh? Hmm? If I invite my master over, Jack still gets to see him. But you won't have to do anything. You won't have anything to do with it. A friend is visiting me, that's all. I see. That is worth a try. I'll leave it to you. Thank you, Marion. Yeah, he seems more satisfied with this. I should write to Master right now, but how the hell do I ask him? Demand he comes over now! Master, get your ass over here! If you don't show up within a few days of the next, a few days out in the next letter I'll send is a bomb, bro. This is the <laughs> worst letter ever. I'll send that anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I like you, Marion. I let I send my letter first thing in the morning. A few days pass with nothing much happening. Sylvester does not get anywhere with Jack, and I keep working as normal. There's no more quakes either, or at least I didn't notice any. Say, Marion, have you heard Sylvester say anything about my cooking? I don't think so. Oh, maybe he just isn't interested. Uh, he seems like a busy guy. Busy, busy! I'm busy too, making all kinds of treats, but he won't even drop by to say thank you. Ah, stupid bitch. Sylvester drops by me all the time. What are you, what are you smiling about? Ah, nothing, nothing. Ah, fuck. Here it is. Here's my boy. Uh, excuse me? Hello, Galliathos. What is it? Do we have a servant called Marin? Me! That's my name! Uh, are you sure? Yeah, dude. I'm pretty sure. What did you think his name was? I, uh... It, it doesn't matter now. Marion is a visitor. Oh, that must be Master. Is it okay if I have my break now? I guess, but don't be too long. Master! <laughs> it isn't Marion. Welcome. My, my. What a lovely castle. It, it's, yes, a castle in, the, in a kingdom with magic. Almost yes. like an enchanted kingdom. <laughs> Don't get smart with me, young lady. <laughs> That's not a lady. I mean, young man. I'll turn you into a lady, bitch. <laughs> Yo. Reminds me of my wife. Eh? Twisted it. Huh? <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> an absolute bitch. wreck. So, where do they keep the bombs? Uh, I don't know. Pity. Huh? So, what was so important that I had to rush over? Uh, why is he British all of a sudden? You know what? If he's British, Marion's British. Let I me made him British at the start. Let what do you me mean show all you of a to sudden? my room first. You have your very own room. And it's bigger than the one at home. Oh, by the way. I hope you don't mind I turned it into a study room. I guess you weren't expecting me to come back. Don't worry. I kept your bed. It's out in the yard. Out? What about the rain? Yes, indeed. It does rain on it sometimes. Welcome back home, Max. Good thing you made back home safe. Hello, Max. Right. Right. Well, anyway. I tell Master that I actually invited him so he could meet Jack. And that me and Sylvester are working together. 
I don't tell them about the king. I leave that up to Sylvester and Jack to decide. Oh, Sylvester's sound, huh? I really like his music. Look at you getting getting to hang out with a, with a celebrity. That isn't important at all right now. Anyway, make yourself at home. I'll go find Sylvester. Then I need to find some paper. Uh, why? For an autograph, of course. <laughs> Back her off, then. I find Sylvester and tell him Master's in my room. Sylvester says he will go meet Master at once. Then I go back to work for the rest of the day. Master is sleeping on my bed. Where am I supposed to sleep? Me? Oh. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> Maybe Sylvester will let me sleep in his bed. He can go sleep in his fancy house. Good evening. Uh, hello. Is something the matter? Uh, no, I mean, I I guess, but it's nothing serious. Master took my bed. I see. And that is the most unfortunate setback yet. Marion has had three voices this stream. <laughs> no, four. Girl voice, Greg voice, mid voice, and now British voice. <laughs> British girl voice. British girl voice. Sleep is essential. So you say, but you're wide awake, aren't you? Yes, I have some thinking to do. Sleep is essential. Do as I say, not as I do. You may sleep on my bed. Thank you. Where will you be sleeping? Oh! I will also sleep on my bed. Oh! 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 Click it, cow, uh, coward. Oh. No, no, no. You didn't see me flying around. Oh, that was too fast. The one at your house? I will not travel all the way there when there is a perfectly fine bed right next to me. Uh, oh. I trust you. Uh, I trust you have no complaints. N no complaints? None, none, none at all. I share the bed with Sylvester. Oh my god. Oh my god. Honk shoo me 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 me. But I don't get much sleep either way. Still, no complaints. It was lovely, fantastic, magnificent. Once the morning comes, we go see my master. Good morning. Good morning. How did you sleep? Just a question. There's anything in the game yet that tells Marion is Marion is a dude. Marion is outright a dude. Yes. Uh, this is a man. Several other characters have called him he by the pronouns he. And Marion has taken no objections to it, so yes, they are a he, and or he is a he. He's him? Hey, dudes can have- he's him. Dudes can have long hair. It's just an apron, it's not a dress. And besides, even if it was a dress, men can wear dresses. Good, good. The... That's surprising. I thought you would be shook by everything I told you. <laughs> you get to this age and nothing scares you anymore. In fact, death would be a nice change Whoa. of pace, I Jesus, say. Jesus, old man. Ah. Yes, yes, sweet slumber for an eternity. Sounds mighty fine to me. Nonetheless, let's go see that Jack. I have been thinking about that. Marion should take you to Jack and introduce you as his master. Right. Master's just visiting me. You'll exchange whatever pleasantries you will and leave it at that. I will personally cut your visits short and handle the rest. I see. This is just to show me off. <laughs> yes, Jack will refuse you immediately. Uh, immediately. Uh, I, okay. If he knows what you you are really here for. A sussy wizard, pretty much, Blocks. Sussy wizard. And should he find out what you already know, we will be in big trouble. Got it. Let's get to it. <laughs> Foolish Marion. Things like these will take place after lunch. What? Why would we wait that long? We don't exactly have the time. Jack will be in a better mood after eating. Oh, will he? Of course. Food releases all kinds of good feelings, especially tasty food. 
Make sure you, you prepare something good and with a nice dessert. Apple pie with some ice cream would be fine. Oh, put some cinnamon in my hot chocolate. Don't forget to add whipped cream on top. Oh, oh, and also... Who's eating, you or Jack? I am a guest. I'm telling you what I want for breakfast. Ugh. Jack will return to his tower after dinner. I will see you later. See you later. Good for you, Marin. What? Your boyfriend is very diligent. He is not my... Oh, wait. I get... Oh, so more than... What happened last night was more than... Do you... Do you think they... You're the... I'm just letting you know, Cal. You're the one bringing this on. <laughs> no, no, I am. But do you think they did? Hi, Wasabi. No, they didn't? Okay. You don't think so, Lama Fowl? Because the terms, I didn't get much sleep last night, and oh wait, maybe we are a thing. Hello, Wasabi. Like, I'm not saying they did the, they did the, they did the do, but they might have, like, I don't know, kissed or know. something. I guess he is. <laughs> I prepare Master his outrageous breakfast and get to work. The cook chooses what we eat and when, so I don't get any say in that, but her food is always delicious anyway, so I'm not worried. Once lunch is over, I tell the cook I'm taking my break. Master and I climb up to the tower. What do you want? Uh, uh, hello, I, um, I'd like you to meet my master. Excuse me? <laughs> also, we are getting a good ending. So you are, Our Majesty the King. Where is your crown? Master, you can't just... Well, my dear taxpayer, it is somewhere more suitable. That heavy thing would crush my neck! Yes, yes. Necks are delicate things, aren't they? My god, they held hands. Exactly! They did hand-holding! Speaking of delicate, thank you for hiring my little marionette. You may be quite weak and stupid, but he'll be a lot more useful here than back at home. There you go, Max. He. He. Mm. Indeed, I can't imagine him being much of a farmer. Him. Or much of anything. Nonetheless, he is dear to me. So I wanted to, uh, wanted to express my gratitude. Master hands Jack a bottle of wine. I had no idea he was hiding in his robes. I'm an alcoholic, you see. I am an alchemist! <laughs> Our town's special brew. A rarity over here in the capital, isn't it? Do try it. It's very good. Hmm. So what do they think of me all the way in the countryside? <laughs> but you're a foolish clown, of course. Master! A no good jester playing king. We're supposed to make him like you, you sod! A disgrace. An embarrassment to our country. Oh, it's over, Master, you fucking idiot! I see. Just as I imagined. What else am I ex to expect from some illiterate bunch of riffraff? Yes, yes. I admit I was curious to see you with my own eyes. What kind of embarrassing no-good clown, uh, clown has been ruling this country? Just as well as our previous oh, king. Oh, see, now that just makes me feel bad. So he's been ruled... He has been ruling it well. And we got him killed in that first route. <laughs> <sighs> well, now you've seen me. <laughs> yes, I have. Up. Oh. Say, what, are you, what exactly are you supposed to be? I'm a wizard figurine. An enchanted one. So, you From can kingdom. cast spells... Well, I used to, but... Looks like you're busy. Sorry, we disturbed you. Bye. I drag Master out with me. Sylvester gives a polite hello before he enters Jack's room. What the crap was that? <laughs> Were you trying to get yourself killed? You can't just start insulting Jack out of, the, out of nowhere. He is the king as of now. Some king? <laughs> Having a chit-chat with peasants. What a funny guy. A silly little guy. 
<sighs> what are we supposed to do now? Guy. He'll never let you see the king now. I wouldn't be sure, so sure of that. Let's just wait until Sylvester comes back. And while we do that, let's have some tea. With cakes and biscuits. I'll shove a cake and biscuit up your own. Come in. Oh, shit. My cup. Hello. It's the beta Jotalainen. Basically. No, 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 no. This is the Wizard of Enchanted Kingdom. I will show a picture later in the... You know what? Fuck it. I'm sending it now. You're I'm sending send it now. I'm sending it now. Oh, you're sending it. Let me go to the restroom, my lord. Pyre is going to go to the bathroom. I'm going to send an image in my Discord real quick for you guys. And uh, I hope you find this image uh, enlightening. <laughs> So, yeah, no, so th to those of you who might not have been here, but basically, oh god, but basically, uh, there is a mascot in the Philippines for one of its more famous amusement parks called Enchanted Kingdom, and the mascot is a, is a big wizard man in purple with a big gray beard. So basically, this wizard right now in the game looks like a, what's the term? A crack version. Yes, yes, a discount crack version of that wizard. Where do I post this? Uh, I'm gonna put it in arts and pics, because why not? Here you go, kids. Check them out. Wait, what the fuck? No, no, I don't like that. For some reason, it didn't send us a proper picture. I see. You son of a nut. Falka. What a nut. Chotto, chotto. Here we go. I got him. Does he have a name, by the way? Hmm? Does the wizard have a name? Does the EK wizard have a name? Yes, he's called Master. The Enchanted Kingdom wizard is named Master? Oh. That's what you mean. Yeah, does he have a he's name? He's Eldar! <laughs> The no wizard. No fucking way his name is Eldar. He's Eldar. No he's fucking Eldar. way his name is Eldar. Is his name actually Eldar? His name is Eldar, the I'm gonna, wizard. I'm gonna kill you if his name is actually Eldar. His name is literally Eldar, the wizard. No fucking way his name is Eldar. Who the Go hell decided the about, about this? Go to the page on Enchanted Kingdom. No way. He's okay. called Eldar. His name is now it's Yotaline, and no, that's Eldar. Let me, sh you know what? Screw it. I sent it in my Discord, but I'm gonna flash it on screen regardless. Enchanted Kingdom, don't sue me. Actually, no, I won't flash it on screen because they might sue me. It is Eldar the wizard. <laughs> His name is actually Eldar. That's so stupid. Look at him, but he's so happy. He's from, he's from the the faraway land of Mars and Thea. He's from the very faraway land of the Philippines. <laughs> Doesn't I okay. I, I want you to take a look at that picture of that guy in my Discord. By the way, if you're not in my, if you can't see the picture, it might be that you're not in my Discord. So go ahead and uh, chat. Put in the command for the Discord if you guys want to be a part of it. That would be nice. So yes, discount. Thank you, my. Discount Eldar. Kill Pyre now. Oh. I'm not killing Pyre. Annette is looking for you. You should uh, not skip so much, even when you have a guest. That's right, Marion. Those tea and biscuits will make themselves. He lost too weight and and sniffed and snorted too much crack, probably. I, I need my hit, Marion. Biscuits. Get back to work, boiling like the tea water. Tea? Why, Tea's nuts. Why did I ever think letting Master meet Jack was a good idea? Master must be going senile. Can't he understand how serious the situation is? Good evening. Mighty fine evening. Ah, uh, tell us how screwed we are. Hmm? Mm. Death is still looming, but progress has been made. Oh, when would you hear that, Marion? Progress. Yes, Jack seems humored by you, Mr. Master. He did. Yes, yes. I felt we were kindred spirits, me and Take Jack. Take note, this man's name is Master. Yes. I'd have said that stuff to him. If I'd have said that stuff to him, Jack would have thrown me out of the window. If you let me, I'd like to continue. Uh, sorry. Go on. Once you left, I pretended to be surprised to see Master in Jack's room. I told Jack you were of the in you were of the intellectuals I'd like to consult about the king. As I'd hoped, Jack was more open to, dis to discussion. Now that he has seen that you are not afraid of death, let's say, 
Shaq would like to meet up with you. Wonderful. When will we? When will we? Bleh. When will we be chatting then? Tomorrow. I don't suppose I can come too. I'm sorry. I don't think so. <laughs> of course not. You must make us some treats instead. I can't keep wasting my time making you food. I have other work, you know. Cotton, ca uh, cotton candy or popcorn? I wouldn't mind some toffee. Oh. I go to my bed. My own bed. I make Master sleep in one of the vacant servant rooms. The others will meet and discuss the fate of this country. Meanwhile, I'm considering opening up a candy store. Yippee! Oh, that smells good! You've been making a lot of treats lately. My master has no fear of diabetes. He's still visiting? Tasty. Yes. He eats quite a lot. This is not a hotel, he knows. She oh. gently keeps reminding me that all these ingredients cost money. I pretend to listen. I think it's time for my break. Oh, it better not be another three hour one. No, no, I, I would never. Anyway, bye. I climb up, hoping to eavesdrop, but no one is here. Odd. Question. Where else could they be? Yes? I. What do you think? What do you think would would fit better? Posh? Uh, for, uh, fit? Uh, what's this fucker's name? I forgot. Master? Uh, what was this? No, not Master. Sylvester. Who's your character again? I forgot his name. Marion. Marion. Yes, Marion. <laughs> Cockney. Do you think Marion would... Co literally, Cockney, I was thinking. Cockney. You know what? Fuck it. We're doing Cockney. Okay. I just like to try my luck with the weird door. With the weird door? Aha! Uh -huh. There they are. And, and there you have it. That, sh that sure is something. So, Mr. Wizard, fix it. <laughs> Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Let an old man think about it first. This brain ain't what it used to be now. But you, but you believe it can be cured. Of course. But you must let me be now. My mind must do its thing. Of course, he says. You must be feeling pretty stupid now, Sylvester. You doomsday preacher. I will not comment on that. Uh, yeah, no, we're talking about what kind of British accent, Wonka. Because there's the British uh, British accents that are like those posh British accents. But then there are those British accents that are just like, Oi! Do you listen? You find the stereotype being like, you, you fucking, fucking listening, man. mate! Fuck you! By order of the yeah. peaky fucking blind. <laughs> peaky fucking blinders. <laughs> you know what? We're going with yeah. a brummy. We're gonna try a brummy. Here is where we part ways. I am expecting great things from you. And silence. Are we clear? <laughs> Who believe in old man's ramblings? Your old man friends would be my guess. Well, I can't speak with my mouth full of honey and milk. Stuff your face with what you will. The kitchen is over there. Why, thank you. <laughs> they go their separate ways. Master! Hello there, Marion. So? What happened? What is happening now? What's gonna happen? What is... What's going to happen is that I'll go grab something warm to drink. And then you will walk me around for a bit. Fork. We walk around the castle slowly. Master is looking qu around quite intently, but he doesn't say much. Just a casual, ho, ho, ho. oh yes, yes. He's too busy munching on cookies. <laughs> Honestly, it's giving crazy old man who actually knows more than he said he lets on. Yes. I'm sure Master has a plan brewing in his old head. He must be using all this food to fuel his mass massive wisdom-filled brain, he wishes. I'm getting thirsty again. Uh, let's go have some iced tea. Yes, that would be good. I am so sorry to any British person watching this. <laughs> Al, please don't look at this. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna stop it. The rest of the day goes by. Master is moved uh, to a proper guest stop. room. I don't wanna, I don't wanna, I don't...
<laughs> she she got embarrassed, boy. She got embarrassed. It's less that and more so. Someone called me racist earlier. No. Oh. Oh, fuck's sake. You saw that, right? Oh, yeah, I saw that. I'm sure she managed fine without me. In fear of Annette's wrath, I decided to play hooky today. What? I'm sure this is a brilliant long-term strategy that will never ever backfire. There you are. Guess. Sheesh. 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 L plus ratio. Where my phantom tax at? <laughs> Thought you'd be in the kitchen. That spicy little lady there gave me an earful. She's lit, yo. Good. And the worst of all... When I asked for tea, she didn't put in any milk. Oh no, will your sorrows have end? Surely one day. Don't mind that now, Sylvester. Has, now, Sylvester's waiting for you. Hey. Good day, Marion. Do you need me for something? Yes, yes. You needed you to... Okay. I figured out... Okay. You needed you to hear my good news for them. I have figured out what is the matter with the king. I thought it was his misery that's the matter with him. Yes, yes indeed. The king has focused on the awful side of existence for a long time. And no wonder. He has to deal with such sad things a lot. But he has forgotten that there are wonderful things in this world too. But Billiard! Billiard! Yes, Billiard. Anyway, like I was saying... You have to take the bad with the good. I think the bad outweighs the good. True, however, that makes the good moments that much more valuable. Yes, like when you finally win at billiard. Does he mean billiards? A billiard. <laughs> sure. So, what I suppose is that we remind the king of good things. Like billiard. Billiard and bi Stop saying bloody fucking billiard, master. Just present his majesty with something touching. Like billiard? I'm gonna fucking kill- Please do not play along. He'll never fucking stop. Thanks for the hydrate, Max. Thanks for the hydrate, Max. I'm gonna go water one of the plants. Thanks for the uh, the other hydrate, Shin. You also get a plant. Okay. Fire's gonna fucking drown, but sure. I can't believe you guys aren't saving your flares on having us be able to say any line you want in any voice you want. You made it first. Alright. However, if his heart has already turned completely to stone, I'm afraid there's nothing we can do. His Majesty won't play billiard anymore. Oh, for fuck, fuck's sake. What would be something worthy to present? Sylvester. Sylvester. Huh? Sylvester is the greatest thing on earth. Um, I mean, just ask the cook. She knows it too. Why, thank you, Marion. I happen to think you are great as well. Stop flirting, fuckers. <laughs> and I happen to think I am great. Moving on. You do have 5k sparks, Max. <laughs> what? What is Let me put it this way, Max. You are allowed to ask me anything within reason, which means no slur, no, uh, nothing that'll get me cancelled, and, um, uh, nothing to NSFW that'll get- yeah, basically. Okay. <clears throat> Allow me to recap our plan. We will attempt to shake the king's misery off by reminding him of the good things in life. Let's all think of some wonderful things to present. We should meet here tomorrow to review our choices. And then agree on one, and go meet the king with Jack. I say food, I don't know what the fuck you're gonna present, then you'll present probably music, Mr. Music Man. Mr. Music Man? Sounds good. I think I'll go with Billiard. <laughs> don't you fucking dare. <laughs> well, now that that's explained, I am in need of some grub. I think I saw the cook preparing donuts. What do you think of that, Marion? What? 
donut. Why was I that mean, your so? Plan. Why was that? Wait, sorry. That was, don't. How do you say donuts? Donuts. Donut. Donut. Donuts. The goddamn donuts. <laughs> Darnuts. Donuts. It's worth a shot. <laughs> it's worth a shot. If Master thinks that'll help us, say let's try it. I know he's an old goat. I know he's an old coot. But he's considered the wisest man in my own town. I agree. We get. I agree. We give his idea a chance. I keep but, forgetting that you no longer have no. that big of a delay. <laughs> I have a hard time thinking of thinking up what would make His Majesty happy. He became miserable because the world is an unjust place. I mean NSFW up until a certain point. How do we explain NSFW? You know what? No, just keep it SFW. But try as I might, I can't find a solution to that problem. What would be the best thing to present to him? I do think you're the best thing. You said that earlier, too. And I meant it then, too. <laughs> Thank you. you yes! Think the king would be glad to hear my music? Actually, yes, yes. Yes, absolutely. I've heard plenty of toys say that the purpose of art is to move people. <laughs> I wouldn't necessarily agree with that. But I do think art has the capacity to move people. Right. I do, I do not have anything I can offer to the king besides my music. What about you? I got nothing. I got nothing. I can wash his dishes, I suppose. But I doubt his majesty will find that too delightful. <laughs> In any case, me and Master will inform Jack about this. Jack knows the king better than any of us. He is more likely to know what would make his majesty the happiest. See, Max, this is why I want to commend you. Because you actually bother asking whether or not something is okay first before you do it. <laughs> we love you, Max. Or sorry, forgive me, that's parasocial. We appreciate you very much, Max. We cannot say I love you to people we do not know personally. All right, we appreciate <laughs> you very much, Max. All right, I'll leave it to you. I slack off. off for the rest of the day. Annette is ready to kick my- is ready to shove a fucking ladle up my ass. Once Annette has left the kitchen, I go grab myself some donuts. Yum, yum, yum. Wakey, wakey. Oh. Good morning. Don't you want to see the grand finale? <laughs> We're about to decide what to present the king. I doubt I'm allowed. Oh, uh, that's too posh. I doubt I'm allowed to join that discussion. I'm not even supposed to know about it. <laughs> I'll leave the door slightly open for you. Aw, oh, he knows us so well. I have never gotten dressed so fucking quickly. I'm very careful not to make a sound. The other three are absorbed in their discussion. Of course I've thought about it. But it's useless. Even before I put his majesty to sleep, he didn't care about anything. I see. I do not have any more ideas myself. But I do know it's not going to be billiard. <laughs> Fucking billiard! Ho 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 ho. Oh, it would be hard to set it up in that tiny room. Why do we have... What do we have left? Only Sylvester? I think his music is the way to go. Me and my wife are fans. Uh, I'm flattered, but this is a matter of the country's safety. Um, let him listen to it with some tasty wine. What do you suggest, Jack? Oh, and freshly breaked, uh, baked cinnamon rolls. I agree with the country bumpkin. Or hot cross buns. I used to go listen to you play when I was stressed. His Majesty hasn't heard any music for months now. Perhaps he'd at least like to destroy the place while listening to some tunes. That's actually true. It's settled. We'll present the king with Sylvester. Very well. This is quite a heavy gamble. Pretty much. But since everyone is in agreement, I'll do my best. Yes, this old man- You know what, Max? I'm okay with that. This this old man really wants to make that stick hit the balls in Billiard. <laughs> Billiard. Billiard. <laughs> Billiard. He really wants to poke Billiard. some balls there with, this, with a big long stick. At this point, I sneak down the stairs and hide. Billiard. 
The other three pass by. Master notices me. Why, it's Marion. Master, you fucking moron. What are you doing here? I I was just... I'll fetch you some wine and baked goods. You weren't kidding about that, I see. Of course not. You must be hungry after sleeping for so long. Shh, you old fool! We're going! Oh. Alright, Marion. I will wait for you over there. He points to the direction of the creepy fucking door. Oh, looks like I have no choice. Oop. Hi, ah, Annette. There you are? I caught a cold. You no, turned no. her British too? <laughs> She's British. Everyone's British now. I, I caught a cold. No, I sprained my, uh, sprained my ankle. Bull. I'm so pissed at you right now. I can't put it into words. I'm simply going to scream. Oh, my. Are you ready? Uh, yeah? Yeah? A high-pitched shriek fills the kitchen. It echoes within my head, increasing in volume every time it bounces off a wall. What toy is she? Is she a rag doll? She's a, it's a raggedy doll, yeah. Oh yeah, Raggedy Ann. It yeah, makes sense, makes sense. <laughs> what is What is the matter? Oh, hello, guys. Those nothing anymore. I had to scold Marion for a bit. Next time you're a no-show, you must let me know. That's what you're mad about. Not the actual slacking off herself. Of course, I have to organize the day, and everything goes out the window with one toy missing. Ah, I see. I'm I'm very sorry. That is to say, today has been planned without you in the picture. Ah, good, because I'm actually uh, here to grab some wine and buns. Mm. And that takes a deep breath when I make my swift exit before she launches another screen. Guess there'll be no wine for the master. Uh, um, here. Hey. Galeathos hands me a bottle and a basket full of baked goods. See, okay, can I ship it? They're like the night more than Sylvester, I see. I'm the night more than Jack, Sylvester, and Bunny. Oh, Jack makes sense. I feel like Jack, uh, uh, if we go down Jack's route, I feel like there's a thing mm. about him, you know? Hmm. Rouse the Nets wrath twice for them is... It must be important. Thank you, Galeathos. No problem, Marion. Oh. My goodness. Ah! Uh... I ship it, chat. I ship it, everybody. What class? What would the master be? Yeah, he said he's a toy wizard. Yeah, the knight is trying to be nice. He's just dumb. Completely normal conversation between me and the guard. The correct names and everything. What a day to be remembered. I hope the king won't kill us within the next hour. <laughs> there you are. With the goods! The other two went in already. Hold on a bit. About time! You are the taste of delights. I don't... But why? They're good. You'll be happy. I can't help but agree with that. D aren't you coming in? N no, no. It's okay. Oh, shit. Motorcycle. There goes fire. Motorcycle gone. There goes fire. I think having a complete stranger there wouldn't do any good. Point taken. Good luck. <laughs> Give him the treats. What are the chances this won't work? Yeah, we'll see. Jack goes back in without saying a word. <laughs> Look at that, Marion. With his hands full, he didn't properly close the door. You smart old coot. Now we can peek. Da, 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 da. Oh. Sneaky old man. <laughs> oh wow. It's hard to see, but someone is laying on a bed surrounded by a faint glow. It must be the king. Whenever you're ready. I have to get the a hunter must haunt. Hunter. I suppose I'm ready now. 
Jack does something with a feather, the globe disappears. <sighs> what the fuck? Hi there. Can I do the voice for this one? <laughs> sure, go ahead. <laughs> Tickles the king. Yeah, we're gonna tickle the king awake. What voice do you think he should have? Depressed. Oh, okay. My normal voice then. Okay. Uh, no, I'm kidding. Uh, that's him. That's the king. He looks a lot worse in the paint than in the paintings I've seen of him. A lot skinnier, sicklier too. Good morning. <laughs> Jack. What is the meaning of this? Well, if you must know... Put me back to sleep at once! Well, which is it? Do you want the answer or do you want to sleep? I can't give you both, you grumpy old bastard! I may not know much about how to address a king, but I know it's not like that. You ask me what I want, Jack. I want to wipe out this cursed world. There is nothing worth saving. And everything worth destroying. <laughs> oh shit! Uh, you know what? I have to get that. I have to get that. Mm. Only a complete obliteration can bring forth a new dawn. I must. <laughs> that's, that's, that's great. Jack shoves a cinnamon roll right in his majesty's royal mouth. Anyhow. Was that even picked up by the mic? <laughs> yes. Did the mic? I mean, Discord picked it up. Yep. Rip Cal's anyway. voice. Cal's voice is fine. <laughs> you forget. Anyhow. I can possess several people, Max. Mm -hmm. That's all well and good. But before that... I have a friend here. He would like to play you a little song. <laughs> My name is Sylvester Sound. I am a music box. I have no interest in you nor your music, Sylvester Sound. Finish your food at least. You need energy to destroy this place, yes? Jack is so fucking loyal when you think about it. Eh? He's my homie, he's my boy. Yeah, no, the, he's, he's real. He's one of them real ones. Very well. What is my dear Jack's final request? Is that what one would call a request? I shall hear your song. Thank you, your majesty. You have until I finish this bottle of wine. Then, death awaits you, Sylvester Sound. And you too, Chuck, you bloody choker. Yes, yes, as always. <laughs> so I have a feeling they have this conversation a lot. I'm gonna kill you, sure, whatever. <sighs> Sylvester plays a melody. I wonder oh, if we're actually going to hear a song. You ready to bet on it? Yes, go ahead. I thought he would play an instrument, but the sound comes directly from his chest. It's a sound I can't describe, only that it's bittersweet. The f baby there's no music! Shut I hate you so much. I hate you so much. <sighs> <laughs> Sylvester's finished playing. The king is weeping quietly. Are you drunk or what? Hmm, my friend? <laughs> How cruel. Me? How? Yeah, I was expecting a song to blogs, to be honest. You, both of you. <sighs> I do not know to- I do not wish to know of beautiful things. But they make me reconsider continuing this wretched life of mine. To carry on living in agony just for a fleeting moment of happiness. That is the most painful thing. 
What do I care about what you want? You're my king. I will forcefully... Uh, I will force pretty songs into your ears all day long if I have to. <laughs> None shall touch my ears for as long as I live. But I can do it once you're deceased. Of course not, you absolute clown! How will you stop me? You can't stop me, can you? <laughs> it is a simple matter. I shall remain alive to prevent your mischief. To try to prevent it. There's no way in hell this man is about to stay alive out of spite. Yes. I will prevent it. That is the most wonderful news. I will inform the country of his majesty's return. Yes, and also you're fired. I don't need a right-hand man anymore. <laughs> I'm delighted to hear that. He looks so fucking depressing in colors next to these two. He is depressed. <laughs> oh, looks like the things are resolving themselves. <laughs> Isn't that nice? Jack is essentially fire. We should celebrate with a mighty feast. Ah. Uh, what do you want to feast on? These All right, nuts. Down master's master's lengthy list of things he wants to eat, including these nuts. Looks like me and Annette are going to be very busy for the next few days harvesting some nuts. Alive out of spite is a whole ass mood. The news of the king's return spreads faster than wildfire. The celebrations continue for a week. The castle didn't unwarp itself, even though the king's back. However, there are no more vines growing, no more earthquakes. Galiathos resigned out of the blue. That same day, Bunny disappeared from the dungeon. It's probably not related to. Oh, did the two. Did they run away together? Possible. Sylvester's gone back to play in his orchestra. Every once in a while, they come to play in the castle. It helps the king forget his worries for a little while and gives him motivation to continue forward. Master went back home with a decent amount of weight around his waist. I could have gone on with him too. I stayed working at the castle. I no longer need my- oh! Yippee! I no longer need my own room there, though. I'm living together! Boyfriend! Boyfriend! And his fancy house. Of all, everything is well now in the land of toy boxing. Ah, We love to see it! We love to see it! That is a much better ending than this. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that, kids. That's beautiful. Yeah! Let's go! Yippee! I'm curious. Oh, oh! Curious about Thanks for the hydrate nuggies. King's End. Oh, there's one where you kill him yourself. How do you have that? I don't. I've never played this. Why the hell is it unlocked then? I would. I could not tell you. Maybe these are all endings you can get anyway, and then these are secret endings. Because I, I, I'm seeing a distinct lack of Jack. I mean, there is Jack and uh, there is a Jack ending, I think. Yeah. I mean, judging by this one, you killed the king in this one. You ran away with Bunny in this one after the king is dead, and I'm guessing this one the king stays alive and you two are live happily ever after. And this yes, one, maybe I you think. never leave home or you just ran away. You just go back home. Yeah, just like fuck this. Or maybe get kicked out, who knows. But yeah, there, there's nine endings, apparently. There's secret endings, according to Lemma Fao, who I don't know if he's still here. But yeah, so we got through two endings. Unfortunately, we will not be pulling a No Good Noel here and trying for every ending, because there's a lot to go through. And tomorrow's hmm. stream is actually not going to be- You know what? Since the story is over, let, let me take us back home. Uh, yo. Hello there. Yes, you, you are out of the jar. He's out of he's out of the jar, everybody. He's out of the jar. He's out of the jar. Say 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 hello. Hi. All right, everybody. 
Oh, thanks for the sparks. Oh my, Max, thank you for ending this with sparks. Why are you? Thank you so much. You don't. You really don't have to do this. I'm so happy. Why would I free Pyre? Listen, the story's over. He can. He. He. He's. He's fine now. What's he has too much here? power. Shin wants to put you back in the jar. I mean... Why, Shin? <laughs> Listen, Shin, we can't just keep putting him back in the jar. Look at me, look at me, Shin, look at me, look at me. We can't keep putting him back in the jar. Because then he starts to like it. Why would you Don't do this you? to me, Shin? Alright. Uh, you know what? I would rather be in the jar than play Dark Souls 2. Anyway, so this has been, uh, this has been Jack in a Castle. What, any Yippee. thoughts, thoughts, Mr. Pyre? Would you like to dissect this with me? You got thoughts in your brain? Um, the only thoughts I have are Funky Town. It's a good game, what can I say? Actually, I mean, yeah, you know game. what? Nemli says that they hate this and that this was their first ever game. And they feel like it it's can, not- It feels like it. I mean, yeah, obviously, but still though, for a first ever game, pretty good. There's, Good. there's, <laughs> funnily enough, in this game, it feels like there's no fucking sussy, well, not sussy, there's no DJ shit. There is no DJ shit. The most DJ you can get is the fact that there's a little bunny boy, uh, that, uh, it's less DJ and more death. Yeah. Would you consider No Good Noel pretty DJ? A little bit. Uh, yeah. Is, it, is No Good Noel DJ? I don't think it's, I mean... Just the whole Yule route is DGen, motherfucker. Oh, that's right. They're into it. Okay, so yeah, we're clocking out at four hours. Pyre is a masochist who likes the jar, but T is already the masochist one of the gang. Yo, I, 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 I don't know about that one, Chief. I know that one. <laughs> a He's little, very much masochist. A little, a little sus. But yeah, thank you. Yule and is semi necrophilia. Kind of, actually. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You know what? Yeah, there you go. There you go. There it is. I think it's cross-dressing, it's just that the apron is shaped that way. They're wearing pants and a shirt. That's not cross-dressing. Yep. <laughs> anyway, okay, so does anyone know when the new part of Andy and Lele is coming out? Because I keep seeing, I keep seeing, like, I do keep seeing updates. But I'm not actually sure when it'll really come out. But anyway, Pyre, you want to tell the people what you got going on this week? If you have anything else you want to, that's going to be happening? Well, this this Wednesday is going to be Terraria with Owl and T, and then of Sunday is going to be Dark Souls 3. Yeah, I'd love to see that. So, uh, as for me, tomorrow, we are finally, hopefully, no, I refuse, we are absolutely going to be finishing Bokura tomorrow. We're finishing Yippee! Bokura with Ajax tomorrow, goddammit. So if you guys want to watch that, uh, the times are in my Discord. By the way, if you're not in my Discord, go ahead. Yeah, Terraria and Dark Souls 3 for, for, for Pyre. And then for me, tomorrow is Bukura. We're probably going to play some Siege this week. As for that, I don't know when exactly. By the way, we might actually continue Date with Death if we can grab the Mr. Chick Dindin himself. If he's up for it. Mm. So, Mr. Chick Dindin, if you're here. Hopefully. We'll see, you know? We'll see. We'll see. We shall see. So yeah, everybody, uh, this was great. Thank you so much for your presence here. Salamat sa pagdalo nyo dito sa tahan ng kakahuyan. And I will see you guys next time. Goodbye. <laughs>